Hello. Hello, hello. Hello, we're here, we're back. First stream of the week. I mean, it was supposed to be yesterday, but we're here now, and that's almost just as good. <laughs> almost. But Tattooed Bard is today's first, and Craig is today's second. I hope you guys are doing well today. Um, but you still uh, at work, so you'll be on Lurk. Work and Lurk. That is a good combo. But I appreciate the Lurk. And Craig, you're gonna Lurk now, need to shower, but you, you, uh, you'll, you'll be back. That's, that's, that's good to hear. I hope you enjoy your shower. Uh... Yeah, so I, I was supposed to stream yesterday. I didn't, um, but it was, uh, I don't know. I need I needed a me day. Do you know what I did all of yesterday? Well, I think, well, pretty, almost all of yesterday, not enti the entire day. I went back to, um, I went back to Rain World. Um, started a new playthrough because I played that on stream, but I never finished it. I really wanted to, but I just, I felt like I got stuck somewhere and I couldn't really progress. Um, that might not be true though. It just felt like I did. Um, so I figured, you know, I want to start a new playthrough off stream. And then if I, if I get to the same point again, I could probably finish the first playthrough on stream or something. Just to see how it goes. I don't know. Um, I also didn't know that there was an easy mode in the game. <laughs> well, not necessarily easy mode, but like at least an easier mode. Mode. Um, I just chose the default one and apparently there's an even easier one. So that's what I did. <laughs> I started a... <laughs> I started a... You play as uh, well. It's called the the monk, I guess, where you just. I don't know what makes it easier though. I didn't really look it up, but it does feel a little bit easier. Maybe the the cycles are a little bit longer, um, or like it takes a little while longer before the rain starts. That feels like the only difference, at least. But yeah, it's a really good game. I'm really enjoying it. Off stream as well, it's really... I don't know, even though it's stressful in a way, it's also very chill. I think I said that on stream as well, as like, it's very chill and stressful at the same time. <laughs> but playing on an easier mode doesn't really make it all that stressful. Mm, it's... oh yeah, and also the... the uh, the predators are a little bit more um, more chill as well. They're not as aggressive or... Uh, I think that was also a difference. So it's easier to kind of ignore them, I guess, or avoid being being eaten. But yeah, I do recommend it. If you guys love a challenging uh metroidvania that is also something different you know something something because i can't really think of any other game that i would compare it to i would definitely recommend it it is a pretty good game it is a pretty good game but that's not what we're gonna be playing today today we're gonna be playing elden ring we're gonna be playing elden ring uh, i was supposed to stream in stars and time yesterday but it didn't happen um so i'm i'm wondering if i should like dedicate one of these other elden ring streams this week to playing in stars and time or if we're just gonna wait until next tuesday not entirely sure yet but hey marty what's up what's up uh, well what when i was gonna answer that now like what is up <laughs> How do I answer that? <laughs> because then I start to think about it literally. Like, what is what is up? Like, literally up. I don't know. Just a, she's up there. 
so that that is that is up at least she's up um <laughs> but how are you doing though marty it is nice to see you <laughs> uh yeah she 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 is on her little uh throne as usual i think she heard me saying her name or something because yeah she's doing a stretch doing a little stretch um <laughs> Uh, I've also been so tired because we've been having so much rain this this um, honestly this entire summer so far it does not feel like summer here it's not warm it, it's not cold either but it's like it's not as warm as it tends to be during summertime here like sure now it's 9 15 in the evening but it's it's 19 degrees Celsius. And I feel like it's more common for it to be a little bit warmer, you know? 19 degrees is not that much, even at this hour. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm not I'm well, I mean, in a way I am complaining, but in in a different way for my own selfish reasons. I'm happy about it. I don't mind it not being warm because I'm not a fan of heat. I'm not a fan of the, the, the heat. But in the grand scheme of things, it's not a good thing. You know, it's not a good thing. So I do I do know that. Um But yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna be playing Elden Ring again today. This is the fourth stream that we do in this uh run. Um in, in this run. And last time we did reach the the sub goal. No, it was a bits. I think it, I I don't remember if it was bits or subs. But either way, I reset them uh, on Saturday, so it's at zero now. But we did reach one of the goals at the end of last stream. So that means that we're just gonna go straight into a wheel spin when I start the game. And for those of you who don't know what the weapon wheel spin is, it's for every fifth sub. Or 1500 bits I'm doing uh, I'm, I'm spinning a wheel that has 159 weapons on it and uh, whatever it lands on I'm gonna be using that weapon for 20 minutes sometimes I use it a little bit longer just in case you know there's a lot of downtime with just running around or no no combat so I do I have been using it a little bit more than what it says but you know about 20 minutes. Better you had a bit of a no energy, no motivation, ADHD phase for a few days. You think it's because you stayed home to work, but one, you cannot get yourself to work when you're at home, and two, the lack of physical activity. Even just biking to work really influenced your mood, so today you went to the office. That is understandable. That is, I, I get that. I also struggle a little bit to be, when it comes to being productive at home. Uh, I figured out a solution to it now, though, but I, I do understand. It's been easier to be productive at work because you don't have as many distractions. Um, so you... you <laughs> There's always something else that seems more appealing, you know? <laughs> but while we're at work, you don't really have anything else to do. So you, you might as well just work. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um... But yeah, also, you know, physical activity really does help with the mood. Like, your your mental health and well-being. It really helps to, to be active, even if it's just walking, you know? That is true. I still, like, it, I didn't know that I would be uh, taking a break from work this summer. It's like, I'm, I'm still working there, but it's like they're giving me vacation without me getting paid because they don't really have enough work for me to do anything during the summer so it's like I'm taking a break from work until like I don't know maybe September I'm not entirely sure exactly when I'm gonna be back um so uh I ended up getting a, a you know like a period ticket for for uh public transportation because I, I take the bus to and from work 
Um, but I didn't know about that, that I had to take a break from work before, like, I got to know about it the day that I bought a new ticket. Um, and I still haven't used it much because I, I just end up walking. Um, because the, the schedule for the bus is just not, it doesn't align with my schedule, you know? <laughs> Uh, because of the van stuff to do travels, etc. You broke your sports streak, you know, the one day one sport you were doing, and now you cannot get yourself to continue. Oh, yeah. When you Once you break a streak, anything, really, it really messes with everything, and you just feel like it's so hard to get back into it. Go on holiday then, come to Canada. I mean, I, I don't have the money for it. <laughs> I might have the time now, but I don't have the money for it. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't have money for for traveling at the moment. Um, here as a bot, don't, but don't really want to be perceived or interacted right now. Sorry, I think no, that is totally okay, Orion. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You you be be unperceived as much as you want, but I appreciate you. Um, Orion referring to themselves as a bot instead of a mod. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's probably just gonna be a very chill stream today. Maybe we're gonna go to Rayo Lucaria, I think. Because we're in Lyurnia. And I said Kaelid, possibly. But now I'm starting to think maybe we should go to Siafra River instead. Because, you know... Or Noxtella. We could go to Noxtella because that is also in Lyurnia. A lot of things to do. There's there's no... Um, we're not short on things to do in the game. That's for sure. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I mean, I do have some money saved up. It's more like buffer uh, money in case something goes wrong and in case I need something. It's not really intended for traveling, but I, I wish that I could. I wish that I could travel. I haven't gone anywhere since March last year. And even that had to be cut short. Because I got sick. That was really annoying. Um, I was actually gonna go to Paris last year in March. <laughs> I, I went to Copenhagen and then I was gonna travel over to Paris afterwards. But then I, I had to switch my ticket from Paris to back home because I got too sick. Um, so that was really annoying. And it, it made me sad too. I was actually... I was actually... Uh, because I had to b pay so much more money to get the ticket back home instead. That I was really anxious about my money. And it took me a while until I was all like... I'm back to where I was supposed to be. It, it was it was rough last year <laughs> because of that one trip. <laughs> I don't know how much I actually told people about it at the time, but it was it was it was terrifying. Um, I was so worried about my finances at the moment. Um, it, it did not it not it did not go well. <laughs> I'm just glad that I got to sell my my concert tickets that I. I, I was going to, gonna go to Paris 4, you know, it was it was two shows that I was gonna see. Or that I was gonna go to. But at least I got to, to sell those, and I, I sold them for the same amount that I bought them for, I think. So. There weren't any losses there, at least. That's good. But yeah, uh, let's just go into the, into the game, I think. Um, I think. Um, no, what? No, 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 I'm talking about last year. This was, this was, uh, March last year. I was, I was going to go there because I was in, I was in Copenhagen already. And I had a, a flight from Copenhagen to Paris, but then I had to switch it from Copenhagen to go back home instead because I got too sick. Um, yeah, this, this was over a year ago. But that was the last time that I traveled anywhere. <laughs> that was the last time I traveled anywhere. 
Um, let's see. But yeah, that was... It was... I only went because of... Uh, some concerts that I was going to. Because no one ever comes here. I have to travel everywhere to go and see who I want to see. Because no one comes here. <laughs> And it sucks. It's too expensive too. But. Oh well. Oh well. I mean, it's a good excuse to go traveling though. So it's not, it's not all bad. If you ever go to Paris in the future, you'd be happy to walk. Oh, thank you. I mean, I probably won't uh, want to at some point. It's just... I don't know. I just love traveling, really. I love traveling. And I have been to France. I just haven't been to Paris itself. Actually, I actually went on a road trip through... The uh, whole country. Like, not, not through the entire country, but like... We drove through the country because we were gonna we were gonna go to Spain. It was with my family. We went on a we drove from home all the way down to Spain. Um that's original being in France but not Paris. Yeah, yeah. I've I've been to quite a few different places in uh well we didn't really stay any places, I, I don't believe, except, like, we, we had a few nights where we had to spend in France, of course, but it was... We were basically just passing through. <laughs> uh, south of France is a whole vibe. Mm. Yeah, we... Um, we also went to... Andorra as well, which is also very tiny, so that didn't take too long to go through the entire country. <laughs> but it was so cool, and we when we when we drove through there, it, it was we went we drove we literally drove through the clouds because it was so high up in the mountains. That was really cool. That was really cool. Yeah, it's because my dad he he is terrified he was terrified of flying. He didn't he didn't want to fly, so we had to drive if we were gonna go anywhere. And it was only well, we only had two road trips like that. It was it was that one and the one uh the year before we also went to a road trip to the Nether Netherlands because my my dad and my stepmom was gonna get married there. But those are the only two road trips that I've ever been to. <laughs> but I, I really enjoy traveling that way. Um, you get to see a lot more. At least that way you can really enjoy the landscape. Yeah. And you can also take your time. Just you can stop whenever you want to see what you want to see. And it's it's a really cool way to travel, really. Jesus Christ, I'm so tired of my headphones. Uh <laughs> Uh, wait, where are we going? Well, if we go here, we can actually get to Siofa River. Or Ainsel, I guess, is the... But yeah, I, I do... If, if you ever get the chance to travel that way... I really recommend it because uh, I don't know if only I I could drive myself <laughs> I think I would prefer to, to travel that way hmm oh I don't know if I ever traveled this way before Oh no, I did. 
I think. Ow. Oh yeah, I was gonna do a weapon wheel spin as well. I forgot about it. Let me let me do that after this. Can you stop riding away from me? No! No, stop it! Yeah, thank you, Ryan. I, for I forgot about it. I forgot about it. Uh, okay, we can do- we can open the, the wheel spin now. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, I also forgot to do the- the- so I have it on my stream deck. I forgot to do that. Even though- even though Toonie- messaged me telling me or reminding me about it i i forgot about it <laughs> i forgot uh okay let's see what it lands on god skin peeler I know what that is, but I have never used it before. I have never used it before. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's great traveling by train is also cool. We would like to return to the Rocky Mountains in winter by train, but it's so expensive even for short distance. Train like traveling by train is so expensive. It's I, uh, I don't understand why though. Mm. I think it's isn't it a pole arm or is it or, or a spear? Hmm. Okay, let's see. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's a twin blade. Well, it was close to what I thought, okay? It was close. Um... Beauty planning a, a West Coast van trip at the end of August from Vancouver to San Francisco, y Yosemite Park, and then going back north through the desert kind of parts. That sounds really cool. Look at this weapon, though. I like it. I like it. This game has some interesting names. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you're back from shower. No longer stinky. That's good. That's good. I also I also showered today, by the way. So I'm I'm not stinky either. I'm glad that we can all be not stinky together, you know? <laughs> but how you doing though, Craig? Oh no. Oh no. I wasn't prepared for that. I haven't upgraded this weapon. Okay, well, I guess we should have the timer on. Um, <laughs> I didn't think that I would have. Oh, shit. Well, that's fun. 
Oh, I I enjoy that. Oh. <laughs> I like this weapon. <laughs> Dude, he gets so easily staggered. Holy crap. No, shit. Oh, he interrupted me. That's rude. It's fine. Okay, I like this weapon. I like this weapon. <laughs> uh... Clean gang? No, we're not clean gang. Well, I mean, it, in a literal sense, but not... N yeah. <laughs> You're good. It's just been too hot. I hope you've been feeling better. Mm. I've been feeling good. I've been feeling, well, better. Thank you. Let's see. Always good to see you, son. Hey, the great Sage Fist. Interesting fashion. Thank you. I, uh... <laughs> I actually haven't changed the the outfit until, like, uh, since I, um... Uh, started the playthrough. So this was just what I was wearing at the end of, uh... Before I started New Game Plus. I just really like this helmet. <laughs> um, but welcome in. Welcome in. If I do have a I suppose I'll ask my... Let's see. I just wanted to level this weapon up a little bit. Because, you know, it's... Uh... Mm -mm. So please grant me forgiveness, Queen America. Huh. You, is it? I didn't notice you there. I'll be doing my job, same as ever. Just lay out your arms. Hmm, about prayer. Those words were not meant for you. I know. I'm just nosy. They may be to you, tarnished lot. But my prayers are mine. And mine alone. Well, I've had my say. Mm, what do you watch over Roderica? Oh, I forgot to talk to him about that. Who'd stay with an ugly brute who only knows how to smith absurd? Besides, she'd never agree to it. It's what she wants. I refuse to believe it. I don't doubt you, but I know when something's too good to be true. Well, it is true. Uh, let's see, let's see. Oh, so this is a regular weapon. Because it's not using uh, somber smithing stones. Okay. Let us go back. Let us go back. Uh, should we just go straight to... Well, where we were, I guess. <gasps> wait, wait, I also forgot to go to get the rune. Uh, after, uh... After Godric. I had a plan today. <laughs> what I was gonna do, but now it's like... <laughs> I get distracted on the way. I forgot to go back here. Hmm. Well, seeing as I didn't really do 
Well, use the weapon much. Uh, I'll use it for a while longer. Oh, of course he's uh, out of range. <laughs> attacked him for me. Well, I appreciate it. Ow. Ow. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot that there is an archer. Isn't isn't there? Wait, why do I keep doing this? It doesn't do anything. Could see the shadow <laughs> of the other one. There we go. I'm just uh, letting the bow do some damage too. God damn it. Why did I roll? I didn't mean to. Ow. Silly V? You were told that whenever you watch a Norwegian stream, you had to have to first find out if they prefer red or brown. You, Lipogus. Uh, <laughs> that's, that's interesting. Um, what would, would that tell you, though? If I answer that, like... I assume the person who told you that had the right answer for you. But also, hello. <laughs> uh, nice. Okay, now we can... No, wait, hold on. Loot. Do you have any loot? Um, well, I would, for me, it's, I would say brown. I don't think I've ever had a good red Yulibus. Ow. I was about to roll. I was just too slow. <laughs> I didn't actually mean to do that. I meant to use a heavy attack. I just used the, the wrong side of the... The wrong bumpers. There we go. 
basically means you DM them, tell them my answer, and they either frown or smile, but no other consequence. Okay. <laughs> well, you have my answer. I, I, I would say brown. Um, thank you, Ryan. Yeah, I think it's people from, from the east part of the country that would probably say red. I'm not entirely sure though. But that's that's Yeah, that's what I think. <laughs> but yeah, for those of you who don't know, it's it's like we have a Christmas soda here in Norway. Or like not a Christmas soda, it's like there's so many different ones. Um there are a lot of different ones. And, um... It's basically, they, they have like, um... They award, like, the, the winner each year for, like... Who has the best, uh... Christmas soda because it's it's like a regional thing. Awa. Ow. Stop it. There we go. There we go. They're from Homo, so it's brown. Oh! I thought that... Well, I mean, that's east as well, so I, I, I thought that they had more, like, red ones over there. But yeah, the... The soda from, from Homo is usually... They're very proud of their uh, Yulbus. <laughs> it tends to win every single year, I think. Uh, <laughs> so uh, it t it's it's usually a very popular one. Yeah. I'm not gonna go into detail where I'm, what my favorite is because that would kind of dox me. Um, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say. But the one that I also prefer is is also a brown one. But at least, at least, they will be happy about my my uh, my answer then. <laughs> Can you open the door any slower? I know it's a heavy door. I know it's a heavy door. Look at the details on on the like especially the elevators. I don't know why, but there's something about the the levers and the elevators that has so much detail in this game. <laughs> but this is a cool weapon. I like it. I like it. I remember when I got to my first tower in my first playthrough, I was always expecting there to be a boss fight at the top. This weapon has a fun moveset. Mm. Yeah, I've never tried it before. I've never seen it either. Like the... I've never seen the uh, the weapon art for this weapon. Boom. Great rune restored. Okay, let's fast travel out of here. Um, should we go? Sh should we go to Sea Off a River? We can do that. Uh, 
is there any point in going to Kenneth yet? I, I forget the order of everything with this. Thank you, Stan. Um, with the whole Kenneths and, uh... <laughs> she places her paw on my stomach as if she's like, well, make room for me. Like, make room for me. She is such a, a, a lap cat. So pretty, so pretty. The first time you get here, it's always so memorable. Even if you watch other people see this for the first time, like everyone is like, wow. <laughs> so cool I don't want cat hair in my nose today or any day yeah we're gonna use the weapon uh, a while longer Been a lot of downtime. We also really want to go to Ainsel River because that has. I know it's it's a very underrated boss, but it's actually one of my two favorites in the game. Not because of the boss itself, but because of the boss room. You probably know which one I'm talking about, but if you don't. You'll see. You'll see. I just remember absolutely falling in love with the, the boss arena. But we can do that today as well. <sighs> just a... I'm not gonna- I'm- I don't think I'm gonna, like, kill everyone and do everything. Yeah, I'm probably gonna skip a bunch of stuff, but... <laughs> I don't know, is there worth it? Like, is it worth it getting any of this, this stuff? We'll see. We'll see. Ah, fuck. I missed it. Ow. I wasn't even hit. <laughs> it, it was a preemptive ow, okay? Because that happened eventually anyway, you know? Okay. 
Up we go. But yeah, I'm gonna use the weapon a little while longer. It looks so cool. Like, the design as well. I like it. Hey, Robin! How you doing? How was your hump day? It's, it's going well. Going well. Can't complain. I had a nap today before, uh... Before stream as well, so that felt nice. <laughs> but I hope you're doing well today. I didn't get to sleep very well uh, last night, so I needed an extra nap. It might have been the fact that I drank some coffee before <laughs> I went to bed, but I mean, that usually doesn't affect me at all. I can drink coffee whenever, but I guess it's these past two days that I haven't been able to sleep too well. I know there's a huge crab somewhere here, yeah. Yesterday was your Mondo nap day. You're all rested now? Wait, what is a Mondo nap day? <laughs> but that's good though. I'm glad that you're feeling rested. That is important. That is important. Mm -mm. Oh, oh, I see. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> now I'm like, wait, is it Spanish? Yeah, it probably is. <laughs> it probably, probably is. Yeah, I uh, I just associate Mondo like the person Mondo with Mondo, not 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 the word. So I'm like, wait, what does Mondo have to do with this? <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't think that there is anything interesting here, but I'm just. I just remember there being loot. But yeah, nothing beats a really good nap when you don't have anything that you need to... to do that day. Loot, indeed, indeed. We do, we do like our loot. We do like our loot. That was a very loud uh, bleeding. I mean, I know he's not gonna pee here yet, but I, I, I still wanted to see. <laughs> Just to make sure. I still wanted to see. Oh yeah, we're gonna, we're also gonna light all the, all the torches. I guess I have like three different favorite bosses in this game. It's also the the ancient uh, what's it called? I'm glad that you get um, iframes for doing that. <laughs> uh, Ow! That's mean. Such gorgeous scenery, almost enough incentive to pick up and learn the game. It really is. The one of the the highlights of this game is how beautiful it is. And it's not as bad as you might think. You know, you... The beauty of this game... Is that you can... Ow. 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 
is that if you struggle with something, you can always do something else in the meantime and come back later. Once you've leveled up and stuff. So it's not really that bad. And you can also summon if you're struggling with something. So you don't have to fight it alone. Both like other players, but also like... Uh, In-game summons, I guess. So there are a lot of ways to... Uh, to get through the game and also enjoy it without being too frustrated. So I highly recommend giving it a go if you ever if you're ever hesitant about it. I would say I would say try it. Try it out. Because this was my first Souls game as well. He knocked me out of the thing! Ow! Okay, heavy attack is not a good idea. <laughs> I do not remember these movesets at all, so I'm just... It looks like I'm doing it for the first time. <laughs> you struggle with bosses in Metroid Prime? Well, I haven't tried it, so I can't really compare. But... This this game has a few challenging bosses, but it never really feels impossible, I think. And it also feels really good once you do uh beat a, a challenging boss. I think there are supposed to be two of those here. Ow, f fuck you. Rude! I hate it when I turn into a pin cushion. What, what? What? Excuse me? No! Don't knock me off the edge! Dude, I'm- What? How can you hit me from anywhere? Honestly, I'm just looking for the one uh, torch that you light up here. But maybe I just maybe it's just the one that I got. The beauty of this game is that <laughs> yeah. it do be like that sometimes. It do be like that. Yeah, I, I, the, the, they always turn me into a pincushion. You know, the archers never fails. That will get in your way if you were playing Katamari Dem <gasps> Wait. You mean the, the, um... Uh, the arrows? I've actually never played it. I've just seen a little bit of other people playing it. I don't remember if it's worth getting that thing down there. I'm gonna go with no. Oh, I forgot. We're having an ad. 
Um, magic sticky ball game. Mm. Yeah, I know. I know the game, but I, I haven't really, I haven't really seen too much of it. I just know we roll around as a as a ball. <laughs> uh, uneven ball makes it rough. Mm. I can imagine. I can imagine. So we have died twice um, already in this playthrough so far, which isn't too bad. But it was still two very stupid deaths. Actually, I forgot what the second one was. Like, none of it has been to a boss. <laughs> None of the deaths have been to, to any bosses. But yeah, over there. I think it's over there. Isn't that where Moog is? Or is it in a different place? Oh yeah, that's that's where the other one was. A hey, rat mama. Oh, so she did not get staggered. I, I say she because it's like it seems like she's with her, her babies, you know? There was one left, I wasn't sure. <sighs> yeah. They don't really care until you start lighting the... <laughs> until you start lighting those. But yeah, I, I love the boss. That like I know it's not necessary, but I just really like the boss. And even in my first playthrough, I I beat it on the first try, and I was kind of upset about it because I love the music so much. I was like, can't you just let me do this for a little while longer? Uh, it's 2024, and pauper rats can also stay with babies. They can, but the, the question is, will they? I don't know. I don't know if they do. I feel like it's a little bit different with animals, but... Ow. I don't know why I keep saying ow when I'm not even hit. <laughs> it was like... Uh... I know there's one over here as well. Well, maybe not. Well. Eh. Uh. No, I wasn't here. Ow, wow, 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 wow. That's rude. What a piece of shit. The one at the top here was what I meant. And do they not see me? That's strange. That's why we play fantasy games to witness the rare and extraordinary. I mean that that's you know that's a fair point. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. <laughs> maybe it was maybe it was a daddy. Daddy rat. 
Could be. Could be. Oh yeah, there's also the one next to... Actually, I forgot where the... We're missing two. Okay, we're missing two. Oh, fuck. That's rude. It's been a while since I did this. I don't remember every single thing. Hmm. Oh, that's one. Oh, they're ignoring me. That's good. Oh, kind of. <laughs> kind of. Uh, I forgot where the last one is. I know this is where you go to get to the dragonkin, I think. I think this is the one. Let me just do that real quick, because I think there's a, a grace as well. Up there. Just so we can no, you know what? We can we also could just do the boss. <laughs> we could also just do the boss. I really thought that there was a grace up here. Doesn't seem like there is, though. Hmm. Yeah, because I need some more flasks. I could just do this, though. We, we can manage, I think. <laughs> well, I was trying to do something. So I can't use that attack on him, because that takes too long. missing
still try it, though. I don't really know why I tried doing that, but I did. What? I rolled! I hate when I'm stuck in animation. <laughs> Let's not do anything stupid. <laughs> Even though I have a weapon that has like long range, I still can't seem to be close enough. Expected. What? I roll too soon. I forgot about that attack. I forgot about that attack when he just... I don't know. What would you even call that? It's like it pulls you up with the, with gravity. <laughs> or like the, the, well, the, the opposite of gravity, I guess. Um. <laughs> uh, it has a stake, so low risk. Yeah. That is true. Yeah, I also didn't have all my flasks. And I, this this weapon isn't doing a whole lot of damage because I didn't get to level it up as much, but... It also has been a really long time since I did any of these bosses, so I don't remember all the attack patterns. Stop it. Also, the issue with like bigger bosses is that you can't always see what they're gonna do. So you kind of just have to learn the attacks because you kind of have to memorize like, oh, oh, that's the attack. But you can't see it. You just have to know the rhythm of the attacks. Ow.
Oh, yeah. I, I also forgot about that again. Which is what killed me earlier. Ow! I forgot about that. No! I was locked onto the wrong leg. Ow. That took longer than I thought. <laughs> Every single time I forget about that attack. It's like, <laughs> it doesn't stick. <laughs> uh. This time I remembered. First time. We got it. I have used a lot of potions though. <laughs> uh. Ow! I really thought that I had dodged that. Well, red was the first color that came to mind. But how you doing, Jean? Um, we did it. Yeah, that that took a lot longer than I was expecting. <laughs> um, but we did it. We did it. Thank you, Ryan. I forgot to two-hand it too, didn't I? The weapon. Okay, let's see. I really forgot where the... the beacon was. Let's go back down here. Red was yesterday? Oh, damn. Oh, damn. What what is it today? <laughs> oh no, I am two-handing it. Okay. No excuse then. No. <laughs> uh Damn, where is the last one? Wait, is that one not lit? Maybe it's that one then. Oh, it is this one. <laughs> Ow, stop it. There we go. There we go. Blue, of course it is. If it's not red, it's always blue. <laughs> uh, yeah, let us fight the the 
the big moose or a deer. I, I don't know. It looks like a moose to me. But it has the best music in the game. That's why I want to do it. I don't even remember what you get from fighting the boss. I mean, I know you get an achievement, but I already have the achievements. <laughs> mm. I was farther away than I thought. Should have just fast traveled. But it's fine. Yeah, I've just been hearing sound on my uh, left ear for a good while now. I'm so I'm so tired of having. It's not really the headphones because the headphones are fine. It's the the cable, but it's ugh, it's so annoying. I need some water. Yeah, so we die three times. Three times in total. <laughs> yeah, this boss is really pretty. All the, the fight itself, I mean. Okay, that did nothing, so I'm not gonna do that either. There's only a few select bosses you can do that with, it seems. Am I here too early? Because I'm doing so little damage even when I have leveled it up. Just, I mean, I haven't leveled it up too much. But I feel like my weapon is doing less damage than I thought it would. At least it's a pretty chill fight. Ow. What? I rolled! I rolled out of time too. I'm doing very little damage. <laughs> but it's fine. At least we can enjoy the nice music for a while longer. Ow. 
I will way too soon. Way too soon. Ow. Way too soon again. <laughs> Why do I always roll too soon on that one? Every time. What? That's fine. Thank God, that took so long. <laughs> and it wasn't really worth it, yeah. I assumed that it wouldn't be worth it, but you know, I kind of just wanted to. I kind of just wanted to. Mm. Yeah, let's just go back. Let's go back. I mean, it is a cool weapon though, this one. Let's see. I forgot to read about it. Unique twin blade wielded by godskin apostles characterized by its disturbing design. One end features sickle for slicing attacks while the other boasts a winding spike for boring into flesh. Much skill is required to wield this weapon due to its as uh, asymmetric nature. Uh, spin armament overhead and then plunge it into the ground to summon a raging vortex of black flames. Hold to create an initial flame tornado while spinning the armament. Mm. I do like it. I do like it. Uh, isn't there a thing to like take me out of here? <laughs> thought that would be in here. <laughs> uh, I guess I need to go into the middle of the room or something. I guess. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Yeah, uh, as you, you see, as you can see, it's been a while. It has been a while. Mm, did the thing. Yeah, I did the thing. <laughs> Thank you, Ryan. Um, is there anything else to do here at the moment? I mean, I could go up the elevator. Or can I? Do I have what I need for that? I also forgot to get... Isn't there, like, Grace... Uh, over here. Uh, 
Oh, so yeah, here's the, the Mogwin dynasty. So it is, it is right here. This is how you enter, like, that over there. Well. Up there. Is where you enter the DLC. Which we're pretty far away from, from doing. <laughs> but up there. There it is. Let's just, uh, run past all of the- wait, where does this one take me again? I'm just too nosy because I don't remember. I was curious earlier on, but I wanted to- I wanted to light all the beacons before I did that. Really? I saw this one too and I was curious about this one as well. <laughs> That's so annoying. I thought it would take me to a different place, like a different uh, area altogether. I don't know if I've ever used that before. Have I? I don't recall. Oh well, at least I know and we'll probably forget at some point, maybe later. We'll, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, I thought that there would be a grace up here as well, somewhere near the elevator. Ow, uh, why? You shouldn't be that good at aiming. I really thought that there was a grace here. Oh, there is. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I knew there was something. Damn, they're running up the stairs too. Yeah, let's go up the... Up this. Uh, won't this one take me to Kaled? I think it does. I'm just gonna get the grace. I think I made a clip to see how long this elevator took, and it took 40 seconds. I think. I think it took 40 seconds. Which is pretty wild. Or maybe, maybe it wasn't this one? I mean, it was one of them. <laughs> Imagine that this, this is this is how we get to Kaelid for the first time in this playthrough. <laughs> uh, very different than than the first time, that's for sure. Very different indeed. Let's go. go to Ainsel. No, actually I don't. Never mind. Let's go to Rhea Lucaria. Let's let's do let's do that. When you have when you have so many choices, you know? It's too much. Also, 
I didn't see Dialos because I, I, well, I'm, I guess I missed him. <laughs> I guess I missed him. Because this whole area is very confusing to me. Like, in my first playthrough, I missed so many things in Lyrania. Because it's such a huge area. It is a pretty big area. Yeah, burn him on me. Yeah, I kind of want to stick to this weapon for a little while to get to, to learn it properly. Hate that attack. Also, I've been ha I've had to fight my urge to start a new playthrough of Sekiro because <laughs> I've been watching I've been watching demo play it and I'm so tempted to, to play it again. But then it will mess up my, my muscle memory with this game, because... <sighs> the controls are so different. And even after Liza P, when I started my, my seamless co-op run of, of Elden Ring, I still had the muscle memory to try to parry instead of... <laughs> instead of rolling. So it wouldn't be smart to mix the, these two games. And uh, can I stuff you said last? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, 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 go ahead. You, you. Sure. Slaughtered, but alas, but all you need do is snatch it from the big pot. <laughs> Pretty the poor, poor, poor. <laughs> Wait, what does she mean by the big pot? Is she talking about the 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 mountaintop of giants, the flame? I mean, it probably is. It probably is. Also, I forgot to turn up the audio because uh, I was told last... Well, not last time, but the one before that it was a little bit low, so I forgot to bump it up. I forgot. But now it should be a little bit louder. Looking for Latena, did you say something about that today? Rhea, Bach, not sure if you said about them or patches. Uh, I guess I did. But yeah, I get distracted on the way, so I find... 
<laughs> I find new things to do, but that doesn't mean that I don't intend to do other things. It's just it doesn't it doesn't go as l I can't do it in in a very linear way. Um, <laughs> so it's like I am gonna do it at some point. It's just now I find found something else to do. <laughs> Relatable, yeah, yeah. But we, you're right, We, I am gonna do that as well. Ow. Relatable. Mm. We'll get to it eventually. Actually, I forgot that you can just skip all of the things in 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 the middle here. We have been graced by a grace. But yeah, that that's the thing about Lyurnia, and like Lyurnia is just very overwhelming to me <laughs> because there's so many things to do. There's so many things to do. I don't want to get spoiled by the DLC stuff. Stop a game. I feel like if you haven't bought the DLC, you shouldn't have the cutscenes, or not the cutscene, but like the. The loading screens from the DLC. Mm. Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. Isn't this... Yeah, 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 I forgot about this. I was like, isn't there something about Yura here? But I wasn't sure how, like, the thing was. Sure, we can do that. Might be a little bit rough, though, because I'm using this weapon. <laughs> they must have gotten with the new patch, the new loading screens. Most of them are also in the digital art book thing. Hmm. Easy. <laughs> uh, that was a lot easier than I thought. Kick their bottoms. Hey, Scoot! How you doing? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. Didn't realize they also happened if not not had the DLC already. Yeah, I feel like they shouldn't. I feel like it shouldn't be a thing. They should have only been with the DLC. Huh. Oh, it's you. Thanks for your help there. You're welcome. My bloody finger was a thorn in my side. And now I'm finally rid of him. Here's a token of thanks. Please, take it. Thank you. I may not have much time. I'm dying to see you. Eleonora. Violet bloody finger. We will see her too. Yes, I've been tracking Eleonora for quite some time. She is the deadliest of all bloody fingers. She's felled many an old hand already, but in spite of her cess blood zealotry, Eleonora is a proud knight. If she comes for you, do not think twice. You must flee. There is no shame in self-preservation. I do not flee. He also told me not to fight the dragon, but he was happy about that too, so, you know. Be on your way. Perhaps we will meet again. 
if fate permits. We're doing all right. That's good. I'm Be glad. Your way, perhaps we... Um, how I've been? I've been. I've been okay. I've been okay. It, it has its ups and downs, you know. But I feel like I'm doing okay. Hm. Yeah, honestly, it's been nice now because I don't. I don't have to work. Uh, at the moment, they don't have enough for me to do at my job, so I, I, I'm not gonna work until like September or something. I think I'm not entirely sure. Um, so it feels nice to have some more time. <laughs> it feels nice to have a little bit more time. I'm sorry, dogs. Or wolves, I mean. I just... I just also kind of want to use this weapon because it's 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 a lot of fun. Do they still pay you wages? No, no, it's unpaid uh, vacation. So, uh, yeah, that's the only thing that really sucks about it. <laughs> But it's fine, it's fine. We'll manage. We will manage. That shouldn't... I should have been able to get that. Um, but yeah, it's also because of, um, well, I've had to, uh, well, my boss really said that he didn't really have enough work to have me as a, uh, to hire me fully, but I, I don't, and when I say that, I don't mean full time, but like, for me to have a a contract. <laughs> All right, thank you for the two bits. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, because I didn't have a full time job anyway. Um, it, it's like forty percent, but it was um. He only wanted to hire me for a short time, but then I kind of got him to hire me for longer. It's just, it's going to look better for my resume, resume to, to, to still have the job, you know, instead of just being called in for every, whenever they have something to do. So, uh, yeah, yeah. So I take it as a good thing that I, I'm still going to work there, even though I'm not getting paid right now. Um, because if it's get, if it gets all like patchy and stuff on my resume, it probably won't be the best, you know? Well, there's been an eight. How can I help? <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> welcome in, welcome in. <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? Hey, big rupper. Hi, how, how you doing? How 
are you doing? <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? You were also playing Elden Ring? Is your first time? Or are you doing the, the DLC? I am still not doing the DLC, but um, but thank you so much for the raid, and also thank you so much for the follow. We do have anonymous follows, by the way. Um, but thank you so much. Also, let me catch up and see who who was here. A chrono bay chrono. How do you say, do you pronounce the e at the end or not, <laughs> Mister Mor Moso? Welcome in, welcome in, and Green Thumb, welcome in as well. Um, and John streams. That streams it. <laughs> Do you stream it? <laughs> but thank you so much for the raid. Also, for those of you who are new here, my name is Repricos. I'm a Norwegian streamer. I'm currently playing Elden Ring for my my like for the. I would say second time, but at the same time, I have also played a uh, seamless co-op, so I have finished it before, uh, twice. It's just only once single player. So this is my second time, and I'm playing. Plural. I'm playing New Game Plus. Uh, <laughs> I'm playing New Game Plus, and um, yeah, yeah, we have died three times so far, so it's not too bad. But we're doing the thing. We're doing the thing, and it's it's been a lot of fun so far. It's been a lot of fun. Um. But it's good, you're spending every moment of your life running around and exploring. Mm. So it is, you're f no, you're on DLC, but base game is so much fun too. Mm. How are you liking the DLC though? It, it, non, non spoiler uh, review so far. No, non spoilery review. <laughs> because I still, I have tried to avoid the DLC like the plague. Um, I have even muted a bunch of people that I follow on Twitter to not get spoiled. Uh, you used to? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> and John Mon said no. <laughs> uh, uh, John Mon said, John watches it. John, maybe the story was the friend that we made along the way. It's and one will do. Anyone will do. You know? <laughs> I will. I will stick with John. Uh, I think. I think that would be easier. <laughs> but thank you so much for the follows, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, I, I, will, I will give you a follow as well. I, I mean, I won't I won't be watching while you're playing the DLC. But if you're playing anything else in the meantime, I will, I will stop by. Um, but DLC is fun. Feels a little harder to explore, but you're enjoying it. Mm, I see, I see. That's good. That is good. Yeah, I've heard, the only thing that I've heard so far is that it's uh, quite a bit more difficult than the the base game. You would also avoid everything if you were making your way to it. Mm. Yeah, I, I'm just not really... Uh, I'm very strict with spoilers. <laughs> I'm usually very strict. Uh, but seeing as I played the base game, like, I don't care about... Um, you know, backseating or anything like that. If if there's anything like, if people have any tips or something, as long as it's not like people telling me what I should do. But you know, any any tips and stuff like that, yeah, I like it. Uh, I I don't mind. It's always fun to to find some new, um, uh, you know, hidden things that you didn't know about. For example, that also works. Good, good, good. <laughs> Rupper says good luck. Thank you so much. And also, hi, Fennecky. Welcome in. Sorry you're late. You, you're never late. You arrived precisely when you meant to. Um, Always on time. Exactly. Exactly. I don't know why the game mutes when I all tab out of it, but it does. Yeah, we just arrived at Rhea Lucaria. And I went to see off a river, a but it was... Uh, I'm apparently not doing um a lot of damage but yeah i'm also so what i'm doing is i forgot to mention yeah i'm doing a a playthrough with a wheel spin so that for every fifth sub any any type of sub and, and 1500 bits i do a wheel spin where i'm gonna um, use the weapon that it lands on um for 20 minutes it's 159 weapons on the wheel <laughs> So far, I've tried how many different weapons? Seven, I think. 
seven different ones. And when I'm not using a wheel spin weapon, I'm just using whatever I feel like. And this was the last one we went, uh, well, the last one we used. And, uh, or the last one the wheel picked. And, uh, I'm, now I'm just sticking with it for a little bit because I'm, I'm, I find it interesting. It's the God Skin, uh, God, God Skin Peeler. I can talk. <laughs> I can talk. <laughs> um, you can't even get to the DLC yet. You're stuck on prerequisite. Wait. What do you mean? This is a ninth? Wait, nine? Has it been nine already? Oh. Okay, my bad. <laughs> nine then. <laughs> yeah, I, I think... Should we have like a command for all the weapons we've tried so far? That could be a cool idea. Yeah, I have a bunch of different ones. The only ones that I don't have on the weapon uh, wheel spin is... I don't have the staffs that require faith or no um intelligence or the 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 seals that require faith i do have weapons that require faith or intelligence though like melee weapons but not purely caster weapons if you know what i mean the first one was blasphemous blade hook claws rotten great axe sort of Milo's Guardian Sword Spear, Lord Sworn Straight Sword, Zamor Curved Sword, Crystal Sword, and Godskin Peeler. There we go. There we go. I'm kind of waiting for the. Hold on, let me just snooze this ad. Um, I'm kind of waiting for the. Um, the envoy weapons to get picked because that is gonna be a lot of fun. <laughs> and I think if it lands on a weapon that we gotten before, I'm just gonna spin it again. Uh, at least until we've gotten... Yeah, I think we're just gonna... I, I don't want to remove it from the wheel itself, but I just want to... I think we're gonna try to stick to new new ones every time. But also, I forgot to say, big rep, if you need to go and, and do some after sheen care and stuff, obviously feel free to do so. Um, I do appreciate the raid. I do appreciate the raid. He knocked me out of it. That's rude. I can't see. Okay, now it was just stupid. Yeah, and also it's been it's been a while, so like I, I did the my first uh dragon kin earlier, which took me a little while to learn the moveset again because I had completely forgotten. I should heal. Okay. Hey. Oh, I also have two cats, by the way, for those of you who don't know. Uh this is this is my my one of my two cats, Koltusta. She loves being on, on my desk because she loves attention and she hopes that there's room on my lap. So, uh, <laughs> you'll probably see her quite a bit, stopping by every now and then. <laughs> you'll be lurking, need to go check that your cat hasn't burned the house down. It's like she knew that she, you were talking about your cat, so she also showed up and said, I'm a cat too. <laughs> yeah, she, she is. She's precious. She's she's a good bean. She's a good little little cat too. Um <laughs> But thank you so much though for the lurk as well. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Let's see. Look at my 
my my cloak it's it's wet from blood that's kind of disgusting it's kind of gross does that work uh i think so it says that you added it yeah thank you so much Ryan. i appreciate it um yeah and then it can be edited along the way i guess I just hope that that's that's the main issue that I like. I hope that it's not too too much work to edit the command. Um, damn, I should have just fast traveled back to the grace. <laughs> this was a lot longer of a walk than I thought it would be. Um, I'm going to figure out what to do when it can do no more characters. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's also a good point. That's that's also a good point. There, there might not be room for more uh, after a certain point. Let's see. Okay. Should I level this up? I think I have enough. Uh, I think I got some more. Uh, uh, what's it called? smithing stones I don't remember what I missed I think it was like a no it might have been a six so I should I, I probably don't have any then should we use shortened names for the weapons or just more commands like mm, I guess just we might not need to have the the numbers for them, but just have comma in between each one. Well, where have you been hiding? I took you no matter lay out your arm. Yeah, it was a six. It was a six. Okay, but she's here now. Good to see you again. I have you to thank, don't I? I can happily I'm as yet, but and if there's any, well, I certain Roderica. I'm glad she's happy. Okay, let's go back then. I can't I can't really do anything uh about it. Um It's a problem for the future, yeah. <laughs> you copy and paste of that so it had the numbers, but you can take them away if you prefer that way. Oh no, it, it's just to I only meant if it saves some some um, room if we run out of room. But yeah, we're getting an ad now. I usually don't do anything during ad ad breaks because I don't want people to have, feel like they need to be subbed to not miss out on stuff. So I will not be doing anything in the game. While the ads are running. Um actually maybe I should take a short break while the ads are running. I'm not 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 too much though. I'm i I'm just gonna be gone for like the three minutes that the ad will be running. Um also she is very <laughs> cuddly right now. <laughs> Where am I on at the subs and bits? Oh it's it's in it's right below me here. So you can see the um, Uh, but yeah, I'll be right back, guys. I'll be right back. I'll see you in a bit. Go, go get something to drink, guys. Yeah.
Okay, we're back. We're back. Well, I mean, the ads are not fully over yet, but they will be any second now. They will be any second now. Uh, let's see. Let's see. But yeah, so we are at... Uh, well, I did reset the counter. Uh after stream on saturday so we are at zero or at, at two bits right now <laughs> so we are we, we started fresh this week so i i do um <laughs> right. thank you for the two bits um yeah we we agreed um that it would be best to reset the goal. Um, at the end of the week, like the last after the last stream of the week. So even if we don't like, even if it's like this will not be reset each stream, so it will carry over to the next one. It will only reset every week uh, at the end at the end of the week. Yeah, I'm I'm not feeling too confident in this weapon. Um when it comes to uh boss fights, I have to say. <laughs> uh because it takes well, it does so little damage and I usually don't have time to use the weapon art because it's it has a pretty long wind up. But Ray of Lucaria is, is, is a cool area. I like this area. Uh, is this a stuck from the last spin? Um, no, so the last spin was... Um, so I did a, a new wheel spin today, but it was because it was... We reached the goal at the end of the stream on Saturday. So I said that... I asked if we should save it for next stream or if we're gonna do it on... On the Saturday stream so we haven't actually gotten any wheel spins today like we haven't reached any goals today so the one we did was from from last stream so we started fresh today rude I have, I have cat hairs on my on my face. Ow, wow, 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 wow. Okay, so your range is not that good. Yeah, it just stops there. <laughs> hmm. Orion, do you remember? 
I think you were here for that. When I just walked past this uh, ladder, when I w went up here, I do remember someone wanted to tell me, and uh, I just completely ignored it because I well I didn't I didn't see it. That was uh that would have been painful. Isn't there like a secret wall somewhere here? Well not here, but I thought maybe there was a secret wall somewhere in in here. Well, obviously not there, but... The secret wall you learned this new playthrough when you were in someone else's world? Yeah, I don't remember how I learned about it, but it was... I also don't remember where it is. I just remember it was in, like, this area-ish. It's been a while, though, since I, I saw it, so I, I could be misremembering completely. I do not recall. You do think you remember that, maybe? Mm. Oh! I thought I killed all of them. <laughs> I just heard the footsteps of like, wait, what is going on here? Dude, relax. Maybe I am misremembering the area. I mean, uh, hold on. Let me do something real quick. Just like the latest TikTok? Wait. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> I think when I went here in my first playthrough, it was nighttime. There's a dance to an Eminem song involving flailing arms when Oh, I see, I see. But yeah, I am I am not up to speed when it comes to Oh fuck, I forgot that there was a one that snuck. Yeah, I, I usually don't get trends on my For You page at all. Wait, no, I, I meant... Never mind. So I don't really see... Dance trends and stuff like that. Wait, why did I bother winding that up? Dude, I don't have any more FP. Oh, hello. I rolled away.
I meant to use uh, health, not FP. Uh, it's a bit of a brain rot on your feeds. <laughs> your wife teases you terribly. <laughs> hey, as long as you enjoy it and you think it's fun, then that that's it's all that matters, you know. But yeah, I think I think it depends on how uh, you can you can kind of decide if you want your for you page to be tailored to you more like algorithm based or if you want more what is popular in general um so i just tend to not get a lot of the the trend stuff if any really i i don't really know if i do get any of it my, my face is tickling because of the cat hairs. Yeah, the annoying thing here is the, 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 the dogs. They are not a good time. Maybe get a wet face towel for refreshments. Is the weather comfy there? I'm, I mean, I'm wearing makeup though. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's not that bad. It's actually, right now it's 17 degrees Celsius. So it's actually not bad at all. I did mention this at the beginning of stream that it's like, It's kind of concerning how... How cold it is for this time of year. But like, if I was being very uh, selfish... And just thinking about myself, then... To me, it's pretty nice, because I'm not a fan of warm weather. Uh, The only thing that I'm not too happy with, though, is the, um, I am gonna jump down there, too. Um... It's been raining a lot, and it gives me a lot of migraines. Which is, is not a, it's not a fun time. Oh, shit, there was another one. Of course there was. You know the animation when the dog dies? It looks like it's jumping on you again. So again, it can confuse me a little bit. Um, Helmet, like the one in game. For the cat hair prevention, honestly, yes. <laughs> honestly, yes. That 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 would have been nice because it's like also because I'm using makeup, it kind of sticks to my face, I guess. I'm wearing makeup. You wouldn't have thought it until well. <laughs> Yeah, but that's why I can't do it, you know? Let's 
stupid dogs. Get out of here. Because of the humidity? Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's because of the, uh, the air pressure and, uh, the amount of air humidity, yeah. So it gives some extra, like, pressure to my, my, my head and, and stuff, so it's, uh, yeah. That you needed that it well. It, it's funny because I don't actually wear makeup too much outside of streams. I just I don't know. It feels kind of nice to have it as a ritual, but even at work, I don't use makeup. <laughs> when I go to work, it's like I prioritize sleep over uh, putting on makeup for work. Why not? <laughs> it's it's all good. It's all good. Um, but I do appreciate it though. Yeah, I think the, the last time that I didn't wear makeup on stream was when. Well, it was the day after my birthday. Because of the. I just had to go sit in front of my PC as soon as I had gotten ready, uh, or at, as soon as I had. Uh, woken up, really. Wait, where's the thing that I'm looking for? I think it's here. It is here. So I didn't, I didn't have time because I had a, I had a timer for my stream. So I couldn't spend time doing more than necessary stuff. I used this armor set for so long, my first playthrough. It's a pretty good one. It's a pretty good one. I do want to switch my weapon though, now that I don't have to use this. And yes, I, I am a dex person. <laughs> I'm not a big bonk person. I mean, I could be. I could be. But I'm not. But to be fair, the Rotten Great Axe was pretty fun. It was pretty fun. That was the first armor set you came by and you used it a lot as well. Mm. Yeah, I think it was the first one that I found as well. Well, actually, I'm not sure, but I think it was. All uh, responsibility calls me well. Thank you so much for being here, Robin. I hope you have a good rest of your night. Thank you for being here. Rotten Great Axe were like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. <laughs> I mean, it was pretty fun. Ain't too stuff. She, she's back again. <laughs> she, she's back again. Yeah, don't, don't put your, you, you tail in my face now because I, my face is already tickling enough as, as it is.
Oh yeah, I forgot he does the, the gravity thing. Yeah, that wasn't very clean. <laughs> that wasn't very clean. Somber smithing stone. It's just the stream now. Mm. Yeah, it always was. She's the actual streamer here. <laughs> like, she's the actual streamer here. It's true. Yeah, she's just waiting for me to make room for her on my lap. I don't know why she's so desperate to be on my lap. It's, it's kind of weird. It's almost like an obsession with her. Oh, the memories one uh, of being here for the first time. This is where tops will be later on. job. Oh. Crystal dot. Um, how did you decide on having two cats? Um, well, to start, I've had her since I was still living with my mom, and uh, honestly, I was really lonely when I was living at home. Um, and I really wanted a cat, but I wasn't allowed to. But they saw how depressed I was. That they kind of agreed to let me have a cat. So that's how I got her. And then when I... When I moved out, which was just a year later. Um, so I got to stuff when I was 18. And I moved out when I was 19. And, uh... It was, like, two years later that I got serious because... I kind of got the sense that she was also a little bit lonely just being her. Uh, with me and, and... There weren't anyone else. And it is usually a good thing to have two cats instead of just one. Uh, as long as they get along as well, uh, that is. I, I don't know, I just, I just feel like doing it. Um, <laughs> and she was very motherly towards him when he was a kitten. But then, so, so they were really close at first. But then it was like she was... Once he got older, it was like... Wait, you're still here? But you're, you're a grown-up now. You, you, you can leave now. So she, she's been really annoyed at him ever since. So most of the time, she's been really annoyed at having Sirius around. Um, because it's like she was his actual mom. And... Just felt like he had overstayed his welcome. <laughs> Which is kind of sad, because he loves her still, but she it's just not really reciprocated. And it's kind of sad. Uh, you also want two cats, siblings maybe, but you don't know, you never had a cat before and it's such a commitment. Honestly, um, there won't be... I would say that there's not really any commitment to having two over just one. It will be the same. The only difference is, obviously, expenses will be different because, you know, you, you're gonna have to buy twice as much food and, uh, you know, vet visits and stuff like that, but the commitment outside of the, the, the cost of it 
won't be any different. But I would I would definitely recommend having siblings then. If you if you're planning on having two cats anyway, having two cats from the start would probably be best because then you also you already know that they're probably going to get along because they're from the same family and stuff, so Lucky that they got along, yeah. <laughs> Making sure the the others don't eat the others others food. Yeah, but I think usually it should be fine if they're siblings because they already grow uh, grew up together and they they have a bond, you know. But yeah, that's that's the thing though. You can never really know for sure how things are gonna go. <laughs> uh, the question is about having a cat or not at all, but if you do, you'll take two, you think, because you don't work from home so they can have fun together. Yeah. Yeah, if you... If you know that they have to spend some time alone... It's definitely good to have two or just one because they will keep each other company. And cats are more social creatures than you might think. Jesus Christ. I mean, I don't have to deal with them, but I, I, I want to. Why are you just blasting at the wall? You know, it's not really productive. Wait, so are the things that you get here, are they like unique things that... Because I, I didn't get the, anything from the other chest either. Yeah, the... The quote wasn't really on point today. This was such a pain in the ass the first time. Also, I know that I don't have to kill every single enemy. I kinda just want to. <laughs> to get runes so I can level up and stuff, you know? Also, this- wait. <laughs> This was not the wall that I was talking about earlier, by the way. The hidden wall. It was a different one. You think that might have been a memory stone chest? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I guess that probably makes more sense then. Yeah, this was not the hidden wall that I meant, but I think that was supposed to be a different one as well. <laughs> just, I'm a menace, okay? I, I, I'm just disturbing all the books. Just 
just taking precautions before they start attacking me. Yeah, I think I went here my first playthrough because of the... I think it's a legendary talisman you get here? Maybe? Or just a regular talisman. <laughs> I don't know. And this is how we open the door. Okay, let's... <laughs> I was gonna say... Uh... Let's hope we don't get any interruptions now. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. This is also late, but comment that I'm the resident elevator enthusiast. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I... Yeah, you remember when I said that in, in the... The Halig tree? There was a specific elevator there that was really nice. <laughs> Yeah. It's so nice to have someone else with good memory, Ryan. I don't know why I didn't dodge. Like, I have no idea. <laughs> I think that was three hits, and then he was dead. Oh! <laughs> <Ryan>. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so when I said just kidding, you mean there is time for interruption? Well, you you didn't you didn't really have the time. <laughs> but thank you. Okay, so we leveled up um vigor last time. So we're going to go for endurance now. I have said that I would do uh every other time I would well I would level up vigor and endurance every other time and then until I reach 60 on Vigor, and then I'm just gonna... I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Excuse me, game? Oh yeah, this part. I knew that there was a reason why I went here, but I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. But thank you, Ryan. <laughs> Let us see. I think this is where there is a legendary talisman, isn't it? On the other side. Going to use the Great Runes this playthrough? I don't remember if you said that. I have not really thought about it, to be honest. Um, why is the game lagging all of a sudden? Yeah, a legendary talisman. Yeah, you do get double of all the talismans as well. Hold on, let me just open up uh, Afterburner, if that is the reason why. Sorry about that. That was a loud sound. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting to 
open afterburner when I'm playing a game that isn't just a really simple game. Ah. Dude, can you come in here instead? It's just so annoying to be shot at. Uh, shot at with spells and stuff, you know? Well, at least you're not hitting me with a book. Can you imagine anything more triggering than the stupid ones that just hit you in the face with a book? Like, imagine that happening IRL. Wouldn't you be infuriated? <laughs> uh, I know this isn't IRL, but you know. Just the thought of someone hitting you in the face or in on the head with a book is just... Makes me irrationally angry. <laughs> um, you're feeling more interactive, but still very exhausted. Mm, that's fair. But yeah, sometimes... Sometimes... Uh, I think I know how you feel about it. Because it's like, you think that you're low on energy or like... Like, I'm not really feeling like being social today but then it's like depending on the situation or what the interactions are about it's like you can you can still want to participate and then maybe you will feel more tired afterwards but sometimes you also feel like you have more energy as well Depending on what it is. But if you feel like you need to just uh, take a step back again, all right? You do what you need to do. That would be so funny or a very mad inducing <laughs> situation, yeah. Uh, you so badly want to talk about stuff, but your capacity is so low. Mm. Yeah. I get that. Only if it's a specific way, but you can't always predict how other people are, especially when there are so many people. Yeah. That's why it's so nice when it comes to streams, because it's like sometimes you just don't have the energy for it, but at the same time, it's like you're always free to just. Like, no one can see you or know what you're doing, so it's like, you can you can just step away anytime you feel like it. Only if it's a specific way, but you can't- wait, oh, I read that. I read that. Well, if you want to, if you want to die, then you, 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 you can. This is what I want to do right away. No, yeah, sure, we can do this. We can do this. You get that? You wish you could have like that more because sometimes even that is not enough. Mm. Yeah, I think it really depends uh, for me. And especially the people as well. <gasps> we got the helmet. I don't know if I ever got that helmet before. <laughs> 
I mean, I probably did at some point, but... I do not recall. Don't mind if I do. Hmm. Yeah, do you think it will be easier to, <laughs> to fight the the dragon kin of Noxtella with this uh, with the with these weapons at least? But the dragon skin peeler. kind of rough with with a, a boss like that because you don't get a lot of time to um ow fuck i did very little damage though dude these are so annoying when they run around in circles around you What was I saying? Um, yeah, because the weapon art of the the dragon skin peeler is dragon skin, <laughs> god skin peeler is is. No, I didn't. I press Y and X at the same time. <laughs> god damn it. You're very anxious for tomorrow. There's supposed to be some inspection thing and you don't know the ex exact time they would arrive and you had to move stuff in your room so they can have access to the... Oh, I see, I see. Around 8 to 4 will be even... Wait, I hate when they do that. Can't they just say one specific time? Because then your whole day will, will be spent just preparing for that. It's like they don't have any respect for people's time. I actually hate that so much. <laughs> uh, dragon skin peel. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I was talking about dra <laughs> the, dra the dragon kin. <laughs> it just became the dragon skin. Because dragon skin, dragon kin, you know, same, same. Oh yeah, I forgot I was supposed to jump over there. Wait, no, can I jump? No, I can't jump over there. It's over there. This was the one. This one is always scary. This jump is always terrifying to me. <laughs> you have been stressing it about it a couple of days, then posted they posted notice like the ninth. And you feel like it was not enough time to get ready for- to make room so they could have access to the stuff? Mm. <sighs> yeah. Oh, damn. This is always a very butt-clenching moment. Bye-bye. <laughs> no, stop it! Get up! But I hope it won't be- I hope they will come around as early as possible so that you can- you can chill, you know? Uh! <laughs> that was too close to the edge. <laughs> uh... Yeah! Fall off! Dude, you're literally standing on air. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> uh, it took his time, but you know, it happened eventually. 
that's pretty impressive though that his arrows can be stuck to the wall here. Oh, I forgot about this. Yeah, up here, I think, is where the, uh, uh, there's a crossbow. The notice says the visit will be around 15 minutes and they might not even come to all apartments, but maybe you think you'll be visited later on the day because you're hiring the... Oh, I see. Oh, that's annoying. It says before four, they're, if they're not, if they haven't visited, they will not come. Mm-hmm. Still, though, that is so annoying. Uh, you probably not be able to use the bathroom in that time until they have visited or after four. And you're also supposed to visit your sister later in the evening as well. So you hope you'll not get anxiety. I hope so, too. I hope I hope it will be okay, you're right. And hopefully they will be there early, even if you are higher up. Yeah. I, th th I, I don't understand why they can't have a more exact time. June will be at work. Oh, I see. Wait, so you, so you don't have to be there uh, if you don't want to. Would it help if you went to your sister earlier instead? Well, like, I mean, June will also probably be there, but like, what if June comes by later? Yeah, I was, I was waiting for this to happen. <laughs> I jumped too early. <laughs> I jumped too early. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. They would use the keys, but it would give me more anxiety if you went home. Ah, oh, I see. Okay, okay. Yeah, I get that too. I just know some people don't really care, but I also want whenever my landlord or something needs to, to be in my apartment for whatever reason for some type of inspection or something, I also prefer to be there. I have trust issues. <laughs> I have trust issues. Gravity. <laughs> also, 37, That that is not for this game specifically. That is just overall. You don't want them to come to your room. Mm. You not want to go anywhere in the morning. Mm. Yeah, that's fair. That is fair. Ow. It's also so vague that it gives you anxiety because so much could happen. Mm. Yeah. Damn. That was a lucky shot. Got straight through one of the holes in my helmet. No. <laughs> Wait, this is the wrong way. Why am I going here? Why am I going here? Your stuff is all over the place as well, and you would rather be there if something needed to be moved or something. Mm. Or touched. Yeah. Totally understandable. We're just gonna run past you now. Damn, so aggressive. I guess they will follow all the way over here, but... I hate that sound. <laughs> I 
Yeah, come, come down. You don't know if they need to just see where the items are, if they need to inspect the whole thing. In and out, if it's reasonable to expect to move furniture for in inspections like that. I don't know. I guess it depends. You do want to make their job easier if you can, but you also don't know what it is reasonable for you to do or expect. Yeah. Oh, damn. I really hate that jump. It's so awful. <laughs> Dude, relax. What? No! Oh, I thought I would die. All that jump was unnecessary then. I really thought that I would die, <laughs> but he was lucky that it was just down here. Oh, bye. -bye. <laughs> uh, I don't remember what I miss if I don't go there, though. Do you remember, Ryan? What is up on that that side? Stuff like this also feel like when they do notices, it feels like they are not taking account for disabled people and you should have information that you don't really have. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like... Do they- do they know? Maybe smithing stones or weapon at the tower. Mm. I see. I yeah. I don't know. I, it's probably not important though. It's just I. I I just want to do everything. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm supposed to not do everything. I don't have to be so thorough. It's just hard for me not to be. Uh, you think this is just general post to everyone at the building? Oh, okay, okay. Just do everything without doing all? Mm. <laughs> That's a good plan. Yeah. Nothing here. Can't see me. Can't see me. You can't see me. You actually can't. <laughs> Didn't think that would work. <laughs> well, I, I guess it makes sense that it does work, but. Yeah. Do not eat me off the edge like the other one did. Dude. I'm trying to lock on. What? The bush was... <laughs> I know that there's a little asshole. No, two. Two little assholes up there. That was not worth it. Ow. Got a twofer. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I rolled and then jumped. <laughs> uh, uh. 
Yeah, let's go on the other side as well. Eh, just in case. Just in case. The dude that is in there, he really pisses me off. I mean, is it in there? I think. I think that's... I heard you. I heard you. So we do have one key already, but... Uh... So what is, I mean, I know you're supposed to give one to, to Tops or Thops or whatever his name is. Um, but why do you need two? The other one, uh, other one is for you to enter. Oh. Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. I forgot that I just went through the the seal, but I didn't really think about how I got through. <laughs> you know. It's a very pretty crab. Just poofed into the academy? Yeah. Exactly. We're getting an ad starting very soon. Um I'm gonna I'm gonna attack this dude in here. But I'm not gonna do it until the ads are over. In case I die. Only one person can use one key. Mm. That is fair. I can give the the one that I have then to Tops. I thought it was Thops, but I'm not sure. Let's see. It is Thops. E. E. We can uh, kick down the ladder in the meantime. Thopsy pops. <laughs> that that is. Uh... May maybe he would like being called that. Who knows? Who knows? Um. <clears throat> I have so many cat hairs everywhere. So many. So many. It's been such a long time since I fight uh, since I fought um Renala that I I don't know how that's going to go. <laughs> uh. I mean with these weapons it's probably not going to be an issue. But The thing is when I first got here I was Kind of, I was kind of struggling with that fight because I, I think I got here a little early. I'm not entirely sure, but I, I felt like I was under leveled. So I just came back later on because you know it wasn't really a boss that locked me out of anything either, like any areas at least. So I just, I just tried for a little bit. I was also on my period at the time. I do remember that. So I was. <laughs> I was not patient that day. 
to stick with it. So I was like, you know, fuck it, I'm gonna come back later. Yeah, you got a bug or glitch thing with her when you were doing the co-op stuff. Oh, what happened? You helped someone with Renala and then it made you like a checkpoint there. You had not even opened the door yet. After the co-op, you TP somewhere and got killed and he put you into the Renala room, but nothing happened. That sounds weird. It happened a couple of times. Hmm. Interesting. That's weird. It did start the fight after you walked over there. Hmm. You couldn't go back the door. It was all. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this one. Oh, well, now it wasn't really an issue. <laughs> Damn. This is a cool staff. Just too bad I won't be able to use it. <laughs> you ended up opening the door, but you thought maybe it would be funny if the door was locked, but you for uh, you fought her, but you didn't want to get soft locked. Hmm. I see, I see. I mean, I don't have to go down down there. We can, we can, uh... I think it's the debate parlor? I think that's the place. Yeah. Uh, wait a second. There was one thing I was wondering about. Wait, no, never mind. Yeah, because you can jump down here, but I was like, what is even the point of that? I didn't think it would hit me. <laughs> uh, I'd rather not be stuck uh, right there. <laughs> it's so funny because I never even say that word and then... have it immortalized by by having it as a quote you know it's quite quite something well i guess that's why it is a quote because it's not something that i usually say <laughs> You you having trouble crossing here? Okay. This one always scares me a little bit. Oh. Ow. I heard that some people lure this dude over here so he will be crushed by the uh, the ball here. But I think I don't remember what happened with me or if I think maybe he I don't remember if I killed him or if he fell down the elevator up to Renala. What? 
What? What? I haven't done any damage to him yet. There we go. It's because he uses the, the shield. I was expecting the same thing to happen again. Dude, I'm trying to heal. Stop it. Dude, why do I try using Unsheath? Because it's not really helping me. No! Ow, stop it! Well, at least it got better when he stopped using the shield. You don't really like to use that word either, yeah. I... I feel like I'm one of the few that don't like using the word. <laughs> so it's like, is it is it me? Is it is it something about me? Because like, no one has any issues saying it. And then it's like, well, I don't know. Both women and men. And I'm like, yeah. You think you died a couple of times to that person? Mm. Yeah, because of that parry? Yeah, I don't really recall that being an issue the first time. I don't remember that at all. So I think that was the first time I experienced that parry. <laughs> You're just slowly getting back to your own regular color? Mm. It feels like you're less here when you were gray. You can't explain it better. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I I, was gonna comment on it, but then I was like... Maybe... Uh, maybe it's one of those bugs, because it has been happening a few times. In other streams as well. Where everyone just w were gray when they showed up in stream or in chat. And then they wouldn't change back to their regular color until... Until you, you refreshed. You get to commands. Mm. Ow! Okay, you're annoying. Ow! Uh. Stop it! Oh, there you are, you piece of shit. You were just hiding. Sneaky bastard. Oh, I used this for a while. I didn't I I didn't really look at the 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 stats on it, so I didn't know he gave me a debuff. 
<laughs> but I just thought it was funny. <laughs> I just thought it was funny. Yeah, we do we do like some funny fashion. Oh, that is not worth it at all. <laughs> Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I am gonna... I don't remember where this one teleports me to again. Is it one of the churches? No. And I'm not gonna teleport back. I'm just too nosy. Um, because I, I need to refresh my, my, my... or replenish my potions. How did I... Oh, it's here! How did I stop the balls? I... It's the, the the magic people at the top there with the, the pumpkin man. 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 I said ma'am. <laughs> um. At the top, you forgot to go there and miss it first time. Mm. Yeah, I don't know how I found- I, I think I just accidentally found it. It just- it just kind of happened. <laughs> okay. We're just gonna go- go through here now. Because we opened the door. No matter. Oh, you almost got me. Okay. Let's go to the bowels. Bowels. You think you... You could try to signal with a gray color if it's a bot moment, but you don't know if it's like a buggy glitch with a twitch sometimes with the colors. Mm, yeah, I mean, I haven't really seen it in my chat. I've just seen it in other people, so I don't know if it's going to be a problem at all. You do what is most comfortable to you, Orion. You think you might have used the portal to exit from the NPC? Oh! Well, I guess that's that's smart. That's smart. Hold on. Yeah, let's let's do it. You don't care where it goes anyway. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> yeah, because you got to meet the turtle pope. So pretty. These kids are so disturbing. <laughs> Flying knowledge. <laughs> Helmet and duck? Wait, what do you mean? Ow.
There's always one bastard hiding behind here. Or something. Ow! Stop it! Kids really are the worst. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> yes. First time. Good. stream it's going pretty well we've died once though it's not about you <laughs> upon my name is Rani the witch that's me that's this good. rich slumber shall not be disturbed by thee foul trespasser send I'm... word far and wide Of the last queen of Caria, Renala of the full moon. And the majesty of the night she conjureth. And her hat is silly as fuck. It, it is pretty silly. It is pretty silly. I, I, I keep forgetting the... Oh, not the moon. Not the moon. Ow. I hated that attack in my first playthrough. <laughs> No, stop it. Dude, why should you do so much damage? No, stop moving. Legend Feld. Um, it took you so long to realize it was like a moon shape, like hold moon or banana shape. Oh yeah, uh, <laughs> you mean like a a crescent moon or yeah? How come she gets to use the whole moon to fight? I mean, yeah, that's actually a good point. Where did he flee, my sweetings? 
But yeah, we're, we're friends now. When see hide, there are books and light a plenty. Did or not? Come out, say I, or will ye be gravestones? To be better born anew. I mean, I already have the hat. Do you see that her hair is like blonde? I never really paid attention to that before. I always assumed that it was dark, not light. I don't. I don't know why. Ah, thou, is it thy wish to be born anew, to become a sweeting, reborn of my beloved egg? I'm good. See, this is this is typical from soft games. It's like the, the they have really tiny heads, and then the body is so huge. Do you see? Like proportion wise, it's it's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> I mean she she is huge anyway, but that's not what I mean. It's like proportion wise, it's kind of wild. You know how your hand is supposed to be like somewhat similar to your face size? Like the the hand and your face is supposed to be like similar in size. You can tell that she could just grab her whole head with her hand. <laughs> Be not alarmed, nor afeard. I would birth thee as a sweeting, fair. Maybe the clothes are a bit puffy. No, it's not because of that. It's it's just the proportions. You can see that her head is very small. But it's very common for from soft games. Also, I know I can't open this. I still need to try. Looks like medieval creepy drawings. Yeah. <laughs> um, take part of the highly esteemed Karian magic course. Subscribe now to get booked, uh, bonked with knowledge. Yeah. Booked with knowledge, bonked with knowledge. It's the same in this place, honestly, because they like to bonk you with books. So, same, same, but di different. Damn, I was so close to... Like, I, I only barely was able to level up there. Um... But yeah, we did it. Let's see, where should we go then? Uh... Yeah, we can move up towards uh, Ainsel River because that is that is a that is a cool cool bows. Is it the same if it's flying book to get smacked by than if someone does it? Um, I don't think it's the exact same. <laughs> Somehow, I don't know. Somehow, I don't think the, it's the exact same. Wait, wait, I could have just gone up here. Dude, this is so much closer. I forgot that I got teleported up here. I forgot. I forgot. Hey, let's talk to the turtle pope. You're tarnished, aren't you? E. I welcome you to the Church of Vows. I am Muriel, steward of this sacred chamber. My apologies for the unseemly state of affairs. Do you know the origin of this place? How it came to be known as the Church of Vows? Do I? I don't know. Um, also, I remember the first time that I saw him. He immediately reminded me of the one from from uh, the Never Ending Story. You know the one that sneezes. You know you you know when he's climbing on top. Yeah, more. Oh, that's his name. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Doesn't he remind you of him? That was the the first 
thought that popped into my head the first time I saw this one. <laughs> he does. And he always creeped me out so much as a kid. Mola is back. <laughs> Never ending story sounds familiar, but I don't know if you know it. It's a it's a movie from the eighties. It was probably one of the first uh fantasy movies that I ever watched. Like live action fantasy movies. Well, that is a shame. But who can blame you? Is it it, it is also a book, yeah. Caused us, all of us to lose sight of something very dear. It is here by the matrimony and so the uh, we're tree. just going to skip. We don't we don't need oh, to do that. You are free. I would say if you find unless perhaps in which case I do have some some uh, prayer books. Oh, what have very well let heresy Oh, all what have we here? Oh, what have very well heresy all thing. Oh, what very well heresy all things can be con <laughs> Oh, what very well heresy all things oh, can Oh, very well. Her <laughs> uh, show celestial do. You do. Possess any then I would concerning Radigan one repented his the order of the earth. How cute he has a little hat. Yeah. He's he's the joined. he's the turtle pope. And all the wounds of this mirror <laughs> and so to restore He's the turtle pope. To experience absolution. My faith done the miracle. And this time, if you, I hope that. Yeah, I mean, we don't have to talk to him anymore about all of that. Oh yeah, we got the the stuff for uh, Bach. Isn't that here? Yeah. Wait, where do we find Bach now? Oh, he should be here, shouldn't he? Not here, but. Uh, here. I mean, he should have been here before, shouldn't he? What does he show up now? Let's see. Let us see. Uh, you remember reading a book and then it had like a red and blue text separating the difference. Uh, and it had a thing, you don't know if that's the name, but it was named something like Never Ending. So mm. I don't know. <laughs> I've never actually seen the book. I mean, I've seen the book in the movie, but I've... I thought Bach would be near the Grace. But maybe he doesn't show up yet. Will he still be in the cave? Well, not here, but... It was the character found a book and read it and it had like twist or something with the w <laughs> twist or something with the something. <laughs> yeah, there's a like a symbol in in uh, on the cover that is like kind of like a knot. Never ending story has the luck dragon, Sebastian Atreyu, the rock eater and so many other characters. Mm. And isn't the the wolf's name Gmork or something? I don't, I don't, it's, it's something weird like that. I don't remember. Um, Atreyu sounds familiar. Yeah, there's also a band named Atreyu that they named after the, the horse, the, the Atreyu is a horse. Wait, no, it's the, it's the guy, it's the dude, it's the, it's the kid. Isn't it? No. Wait, now I'm mixing up the... Um, I'm mixing up the, the kid and the horse now. <laughs> was the kid named Atreyu or was the horse named Atreyu? Now I forgot. <laughs> Sebastian runs from the bullies and finds a book that he spends the day reading. Mm. Atreyu is the kid. Yeah, that, that's what I thought. But now, like, wait, I'm, I'm kind of... Yeah. What was the name of the horse, though? Because that is the saddest part of the whole movie. I'm not gonna say, but... It's more than um, Okay. Mm. <laughs> the horse is the saddest- yeah, it, it is the saddest part. It- 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 I- It's devastating, honestly.
Wait, but where should he be now? Artax. Okay, so it, it started... Both start with A. Artax. Okay, that's the one. Thank you, Clever. <laughs> but Gamor Gmork is the wolf. Yeah. I, I can't believe that I remember the name of the wolf. <laughs> uh, it's kind of funny. The wolf was so scary as a kid. He was, but when you watch it now, it's like he's just a... Basically just a puppet. <laughs> it's so funny. Uh. Hey, no, uh, I was looking for Bok, but I because I thought that he would appear uh, near the... Like, at the beginning of Lyrnia. Yeah, like the the main villain in 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 the movie is like a is a wolf. Nah, he's a scary wolf. Well, as a kid, at least. <laughs> uh, did I talk? No, I didn't. I didn't talk to him there because he didn't show up. He never showed up there. Um, he wasn't there when I got there, and he wasn't there when I when I teleported there now either. But now I have the the needle. You think he's then on the other side of the the Karya Grace then? Oh wait. Like, here? What do you mean, near the main gate? If you go out the other side, yeah, so you end up here, you mean? The other side I didn't enter? Yeah, that's what I mean. So if I teleport here, there's the, the Euro part and then there's this part. Okay, let's, let's 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 do that then. I, he's only ever appeared to me uh, at the beginning of Lyrnia there, after Godric. So I, I didn't really know that he could appear anywhere else. Wait, I I guess I can just do that. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had to ride through there, but I, 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 I don't. I don't. Hmm, maybe I need to sit here? you are did I get no I was about to do that now good to see you master do you uh, remember me the bock the demi-human yeah you helped me before and retrieved my sewing needle please master allow me to serve you as your seamster I can't make nothing from scratch but I'm happy to make adjustments to your garments don't tell me. Wait, don't tell me. Master, I was wondering, do you ever make adjustments to your garb yourself? I would, well, rather you let me do the job when possible, please. I don't ask anything in return, you know, and, well, I am your personal seamster after all. I'm s wait, I'm sorry? Master, my apologies. Your wardrobe includes the garb of the old demigods, uh, and I'm afraid I can't make adjustments to them. 
my mum told me once. I didn't. I, I don't know if I fit. No, I didn't think. You, I don't think I did. Just wait, master. Before long, I'll be that good too. I feel like his quest doesn't actually get finished, though. Like in a satisfying way, at least. Is that a gift for my undeserving self? Thank you kindly. But what on earth could it? Oh, but I have finished it before. Amazing. I've never seen a golden needle. Not in all my life. I think. With a spectacular royal crest to boot. Are you certain that this is for me? Oh, I, I, I don't remember. It's been so it. long. Have faith in me, master. I'll polish my craft enough that I deserve this golden gift. I'll be the golden seamster, Bok. Now I'll be able to sew anything. If I finished it at all, I don't actually gods. remember. Uh, you're wrong about another name. It's Rockbiter, not Rock Eater. You're in the Wikipedia world. <laughs> hey, I wouldn't have known. I would not have known. <laughs> Do you think that Mum would be pleased if she knew that I'm as good as any royal seamster now? Oh, it's still not enough. I actually kind of like the second movie as well. From scratch, like Was there a third? Or was it just two? I don't remember, but... Oh, going up, please do be safe. Bok the seams ready to make a jump. Oh, uh, please. You only remember two? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, talk to Melina. Hello. Your seamster, Bok. He is always eager to see your return. Please. Will you talk to him when you can? I'm sure he would be much contented. I don't remember her saying anything about Bok to me before. Even though I've talked to him and given him the, the needle before. In a different playthrough. I do not remember her talking about him though. That's that's a new one for me. Bok the sea ready to make it. Oh uh, please. Well he didn't have anything new to say. Yeah, because he has never been here for me before. He's only ever been right here at Lake Facing Cliffs. That's where I've seen him before. And I think that's where I gave him the needle too. I think. I just wanted to make sure that he was gonna, like, that he would switch between the two graces or something like that. Yeah, I think he appears, like, here or something. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. But it's, like, it's somewhere, like, it, here. But yeah, let's go, go to, uh... Let's go underground. Yeah, now I'm starting to get a bit hesitant whether I ever fully finished his quest or if it was just very unsatisfactory finishing it. Because it didn't feel like there was anything... He can also be at the Altus Grace after the Bellum Gate that you can miss before the Landell one. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure. And down he goes. There we go. 
there we go. Uh, do you think it's spoiler for you to know? To know what what happens at the end? I mean, if I don't know, then maybe. Once you could Google again, results only show two movies. Okay, okay. Yeah, I wasn't sure because some movies that are like... That end up having two movies, it's like, oh, they actually had a third and then a fourth and then a fifth and then it's like... <laughs> You know? You also looked at the never ending story and you think definitely have read the book and the pictures also seem familiar of the movie, but I don't remember seeing it. Mm. Yeah, I loved uh Falcor, the 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 dog dragon. It's like is he a dog? Is he a dragon? Or is he both? I mean he he's he's like a he's a he's a dog dragon. He's a doggin. He's a doggin. Luck dragon, he says so happily. Mm. Yeah, this, uh... This area is... Not all fun, but it is. It has one of the my favorite bosses in it, or boss rooms. Again, boss rooms because we the the fight itself is not that special because we already fought one of them today, which was the dragonkin of Noxtella is is the one I'm talking about so we already fought one dragonkin yes Uh, he does seem like he's part popper though. Yeah, but he, he has like a, a dog face. <laughs> he, has a, he has a dog face. And you also scratch him behind the ear, like a dog, you know? So happy they are not uh, other things, but big ants are also not the nicest, yeah. Don't think I can't see you. I guess you're just not gonna fall down. Hold on, I'm gonna run. I don't have time to wait for you. Um. This one has some special effects. Yeah, like the 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 acid butt, the butt acid. You just saw a meme about fighting ants in the this game the other day, but you have no knowledge of what this is all about. Hmm. He does love the behind the ear scratches. Yeah. Yeah, he's basically a doggo. One time in co-op, it bugged and the fight looked. Like it ended, but it never did, and you were so sad for the host, and they ended up jumping off the cliff. And you tried to look up, and you think it was like because you killed it before you did the transition. They're like breed, breed, bleed proc, and it just died, never, not never dying. I never got back to the same person's world, so you hope they got the boss eventually. Mm. Oh, the boss! I see, I see. Yeah, this one has some special effects, that's true. Dude, I'm trying to lock on. Yeah, that that's kind of what makes it cool, though. The, the lightning stuff, or the... It just fits so well with the room. Like, the whole aesthetic of that room is just... <laughs> I don't know. I enjoy. 
I enjoy. I keep forgetting that I'm actually dual wielding because I'm only ever pressing the right side and not the left one. You were so sure the statue was going to come alive? Wait, which statue? Oh, oh, oh yeah, in the boss room. I see now. I'm, I'm, I'm a bit slow, okay? <laughs> I'm a bit slow. <laughs> Yeah, I think I think that's what I thought too. Okay. It looks like a tick, which is disgusting. Let's pop it. <laughs> it's so gross. It's so gross. I guess they never noticed me. Come on. I don't want to go into the room. I want to I want to bottleneck this this shit. Wait, why are you not locked onto that one? Ow, 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 ow. I also don't want them to start uh, with the acid. Okay, that's good. Um, despite the ants, this is fairly pleasant co-op place area. You do like to see off a river area a lot for co-op more. And to be there yourself. Mm. This looks like a fun area. <laughs> that, that's actually very fitting. Not Not specifically for me necessarily, but... Because I don't, I don't have any, any, like, phobias or anything, but I can definitely see <laughs> how it's fitting for other people. Um, but yeah, I, I, this is a cool area to me. I love this area. Also, I do remember the, the stream very well. I think I remember the date as well. I think it was the day before my birthday. Either one day or two days before my birthday. In 2022. The only reason why I know is because there's a very uh, popular clip from the stream that I had when I went here. So I remember what I was wearing and everything. <laughs> One time when you were a kid, you were s step. You stepped on an ant's nest and they were all over you, and you still got get shivers sometimes about that. Hmm. I mean that that is very valid though. I do I do. Understand that. That is that is not a good time. It's Elden John. <laughs> Elden John. Uh, it's not as bad for you than the other ones, but not very nice. Mm. 
We got some celestial do. Dooby dooby doo. Oh yeah, elevator. Wait, where's the? There it is. This is such a typical way to die in a first playthrough, just running towards here and just falling down the hole. <laughs> you don't want to join me? I just don't remember what what I missed here. The statue person has many names. We do like Elden John. Wait. Does do people actually call it that? I knew there was a reason why I wanted to go here. The lore stuff is so cool. Would sometimes get ants during summer and rather than, you know, preventing them or whatever, your dad turned on a skillet they were on and they all started popping. That's so, that's so mean. Typing all that out makes you realize how disturbing it was. Damn. That, that is kind of disturbing, yeah. To even think of doing that is kind of wild to me. <laughs> Um, that kind of reminds me of what my dad did when, well, during summertime. It wasn't, it wasn't as bad. Well, I bet it was, I think it was kind of bad anyway. Um, I think I mentioned this on stream before. But he, so my, my dad, he would, like, we, we were eating outside because we were barbecuing or something. Or grilling, whatever. Um, and we were near the ocean because, well, we lived right by the ocean. So we were basically sitting on, on a dock uh, outside our home. And there were so many seagulls there. <laughs> a lot of seagulls. And they were kind of being a little bit bothersome while we were trying to eat. So what my dad did, it's it's not as it's not as don't 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 be too anxious about what I'm gonna say because it's not as bad as it probably sounds. But I mean it's 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 not something that I would do for sure. But my I don't know why I'm so hesitant to say it. Um, so my my dad he brought some some stale bread. And he had some old alcohol that he kind of soaked the bread in and gave it to the seagulls. So they would be quiet and stuff. So like, and they, they got drunk. <laughs> he got the seagulls drunk. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Did it work? It, it, it. I don't know. Should I? Should I? Should I say that? Should I really answer that? What if I give people ideas? I don't. I don't want to give people ideas. Um, he's a strange guy. <laughs> I mean, it it it, it, it kind of did. It kind of did work. I mean, it wasn't. It wasn't like he. It wasn't. Obviously, any type of alcohol would be... It's not good. But it wasn't to the point where it was, like... More than they could handle, I guess? Which is... I don't know. Definitely not excusing it. But they were... They were fine. Is what I'm trying to say. Afterwards. Um... Don't try this at home or anywhere, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I could never do that. I could never. The minds of our fathers. 
Yes. <laughs> Indeed. Indeed. There's a researcher, you know, who studies drunken worms. Wait, drunken worms? What happens to them? Oh, damn. Already? Oh. Two hits and you were dead. Okay. That's lucky because we're getting an ad in, in, well, any second now. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm just gonna go down to the merchant. Um, so you won't miss anything. You won't miss anything during the ad. Um, this is also fun to show people if they don't know that you can just come here to kill this thing. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I was I was looking for a way to kill it, so it wasn't really difficult to figure it out. I think, um, but so these worms are small and they like to entangle. They form an active matter and a way to control the activities by putting alcohol in their water. It's science, okay. <laughs> I did I didn't say anything. <laughs> I didn't say anything. A custom well. How long has it been? It's an interesting place to set up a shop, honestly. You know, like who would come here? Especially below that one. They would just get rocks splinged at them, you know? Hmm. I mean might as well. I don't have all the cookbooks, it seems, so might as well. Might as well. Yeah, there's not a whole lot to do here, except the, the dragonkin, I guess. So with alcohol, the worms are less active, basically. Mm. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of what happened with the sequels as well. Oh, it's so sad. But yeah, they, they were just... There was one I remember... Th this was so many years ago. I think I was... 10 or 11 or something. Judging by the place we lived at the time. That's how I... Th that's how I remember how old I was. Because I've been... I've moved quite a bit. Um, and... Yeah, so one one was flying around, and it's it was about to like land on on a rooftop, and then just kind of slid down from it again. I mean, it could fly, but it, it couldn't like it couldn't keep it, its feet steady, so it just kind of slid down the roof and had to fly off again. That's that's one of the few things that I remember. Uh, some people miss the entrance, like you two were to get to the top as well, because it's not... Yeah, I mean, I guess that's true. Do I have a favorite merchant in Elden Ring? I mean, I do love Kale. I do. But I'm also biased, because because of I know how his quest would have gone, so I would have to say him. Uh, but placement... I have not thought about that, I have to admit. I have not thought about placement, like favorite placement of uh, a, mer a merchant. 
Do you? I mean, I know you like the ones with the musical instruments, but... Ha, maybe maybe they had the best time of their life, you don't know. I mean, that's true. And he did- he, he wasn't- it wasn't exaggerated either. Because he wasn't- he wasn't trying to kill them or anything, you know? But... Still, very questionable, uh, to say the least. <laughs> Maybe now they're alcoholics and looking for booze all the time. If they're still alive, I don't know. How old can... How old can... Seagulls be? Or how, how old can they get? I'm drinking out of people's beer on the beach. <laughs> um. Let's see. Let's go to the bows. Well, we have these first, I guess. Those are nice, and also the fake one, but you know if that counts for this. There's also the one that is... Wait, the fake one? I'm not sure I know what you mean. So, the one thing that I remember from this area was... That this is where I got my first soap in the game. <laughs> this is where I got my first soap in the game. Yeah, the basilisks are no fun. I, I do not like them either. Let's get away from the death blight. One last time I encountered it, or like two streams ago in Limgrave at the beach. Oh, oh, that one, but yeah, I don't, I don't know if that one counts. Because it's not a merchant. No spoilers, thanks. Yeah, wait, what What do you mean? No spoilers. Soup. It is kind of cool that they have, like, the soap for the exact same reason in, in uh, Baldur's Gate 3 as well. But apparently that was... It wasn't there from the beginning. Uh, that's why you said you don't think it counts. Yeah, yeah. You mind things spoilers? Oh. Well, you said thanks. I was like, wait, did I say anything spoilery? <laughs> Ow, 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 ow. This is kind of cool to see the rot lake now. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't even stop to, to think about it. Like, I know that that is the rot lake, but I, I didn't even think about it now. I just <laughs> I just picked up the, the, the butterflies and left. You were just typing fast, so you think... It was safer to say no spoil. Oh, okay, okay, I see, I see. Melted mushroom. How do you melt a mushroom? How do you melt a mushroom?
It's not the... Yeah, it's it's not very nice. That is true. It's also not a very fun area either. But yeah, see, this is my favorite boss uh, room in the game. This is my favorite boss room. Well, we can admire it when, when I'm done with the boss, though. Ow! I rolled way too soon. Up the butt. Oh yeah, forgot about that. Oh, no. Oh, I thought he would do the... Oh, wait, I was too far away. Oh. <laughs> he kept attacking. <laughs> uh, yeah, this this went uh, a little bit smoother than the first one today. I blame it all on the weapon, though. Blame it all on the weapon. <laughs> But yeah, look at this room. It is so beautiful. And you see the leaves and everything too. They're like... Silver. Look at it. Look at it. Yeah, I love this boss arena. I have very fond memories when I did this the first time because of the boss arena. <laughs> All the nice corpses, yeah. <laughs> that too. <laughs> um, you also came here super late on the first run, so the fight was not for long. Oh. I came here... I don't know if it was early or the intended uh, level that I was at. But I was definitely not late. Look at this stuff, isn't it neat? Yeah, yeah. But just look at the lighting and everything, you know? And the water. I don't know. I like this. I like this well spoon. It's probably my favorite boss room uh, besides um, Melanius. Well, I mean, they're, they're, it's like I can't really compare the two because they're so different. But they both have foliage, you know? Both of them. <laughs> uh, that they have in common. This is a really gorgeous game. You should start collecting berries and flowers again. Wait, in-game or uh, <laughs> IRL? Um, but yeah, it is. It is a really beautiful game. Bok the seamster, ready to make a. Okay, he doesn't have anything new. Uh, please do. Um. They ended up both jumping off the cliff after you kind of tried to make it happen. After one attempt, the other jumped off the place. 
Wait. Wait, what other are you talking about? Mm, collect all the stuff. Always. Always. You don't want to fight the bosses, you just want to wander around? Mm. Yeah, that's why it's- that's why it's like... That's why it's so nice that it's an open world game, because you can just- you can just walk around and- and... You know, fight smaller enemies and just take your time. And, uh... And level up, you know? And then all the boss fights will be easy peasy. I don't know if I ever went up here. Have I ever been up here? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, I am I must have. avoid most fighting actually and get surprisingly many places hmm yeah that's true you you don't have to fight godric to get to this area and yeah i, I think you can get to Lyurnia without fighting any bosses right Yeah, you can skip storm rail. Yeah. Yeah, you can just go through a passage in in Limgrave and skip both of Margit and Godric. You can also get to Kaelid, yeah. But who would want to go to Kaelid? <laughs> like who would choose to go there to explore, you know? Uh, well, um, as a completionist, I would, but you know, I mean, for the scenery, not so much. This was actually the first, um, Night Cavalry that I found, the one that appears here. Like, that was the first encounter that I had with a Night Cavalry, I think. I think. I'm not entirely sure about... No, maybe, maybe the one in Limgrave was first. Not the one in Weeping Peninsula, but... No, never mind. I, I was lying. I, I don't know. I just felt like this was... This felt like the first one. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, we should probably go and find uh, Raya or Latena. Ow! I wasn't ready! Uh... Ow! Dude, stop moving! Oh. Well, that's lovely. <gasps> Wait. Oh, never mind. I thought I saw something that I didn't see. <laughs> also, you can die at the academy for the Virgin Abductor to get to Volcano Manor as well and do to Altus that way as well. You don't have to go to the Twin Virgins fight and you can drop to the lava to get to the manor. Yeah, that's that's true. I was actually considering going to to the um what's it called? The volcano manor just to like go there and get a grace through the 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 abductor.
I actually got spoiled that in a different stream how to get there and I did not know. Like I didn't fi I didn't figure it out on my own. I just killed the one at the bottom there. I didn't actually get abducted. So when I saw it in someone else's stream and I wasn't even planning like I I tried really hard to stay away from streams as well. So I don't know how I even managed to get spoiled. But I got there so late. <laughs> I think you should be able to get through the manor without fighting the bosses. Yeah. Yeah, no, I knew what you meant. Uh, there are some quests I get locked or missed if you go to plateau. Yeah, I wasn't planning on going to the plateau. I don't even know if I have the all the medallions either. No, rude. Yeah, I don't know if I have the, the medallions needed for it either. I have one half, but I don't know if I have both. Yeah, because you need the other one in Kaled, right? And I haven't been to Kaled. Or is that the one for... um? Yeah, the one with the, the bats. Okay. So, Raya, she should be on this side, right? Maybe I should just go down here, then. <laughs> Where I already am. Mm, it was so painful to not say anything, and you were so surprised you killed that as well. Yeah, but there are different ways you can get there, though. Yeah, I got there the, I guess, intended way? For once? For once I got someplace the intended way instead of on accident. And apparently the accidental way is how you're supposed to do it. So it's like, was it really the intended way? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, both are the intended way. Wait, isn't there like a, an airlift over here? Somewhere? Oh, it's on the other side, maybe? Are you not sure if manor counts as Altus Graces because Altus Graces start their... Redon Festival as well. Yeah, in that sense, I don't know if it counts either. I don't know. I thought there would be one here. Where is it? It also patches, tells about the abductor in the Lyurnia Grace. Yeah, but I killed him in my first playthrough. <laughs> I killed him in my first playthrough. He took a tumble off the cliff. Uh, but you didn't meet him in Lyurnia. But now when doing a new run. Mm. Yeah, I, I... I didn't mean to kill him though. It just happened. You know, I'm, I am gonna fast travel because this is annoying. This is annoying. <laughs> I 
I don't have any graces on this side of the the academy. Oh, wait. I actually landed on the tree. Bogart also is mystic going to manor before talking to him. Wait, who is Bogart? Wait, are you talking about Bok? Wait, and talking to him and getting the necklace thing because Raya will move to the manor? I have never done Raya's quest. The crabs? Oh, oh, the crab dude. Oh, I had no idea what his name was. I just I just know that he's in the crab shack thing. Uh wait, I also meant to go to to Ah oh, fuck. See, they, I'm I'm just like there's so many things to do. I thought that was her name. But yeah, I think I got locked out of her quest. Um, because she never showed up at the manor for me. I think. I think she never showed up there. Only here. In my first playthrough. Yeah, I'm not I'm not really sure where I'm going right now. I'm just I'm just going because I don't see the the middle part of of Lyrna is so annoying to me. Like the the lake part of it. I want that loot. You didn't fight the god skin before by card, so you couldn't get the item. Yeah, I don't even know what item you're talking about because, I, again, I, I haven't done it. I'd never gotten to that point in, in my off stream playthrough either, where I started doing all the different quests. I think the last boss that I did was Radon, like major boss. God damn it! Jesus Christ! Holy crap! I have never seen that happen before. That was wild. Going from the, res the responsibilities from all the quests. Well, I'm not trying to. <laughs> There's just- I'm just a little bit overwhelmed because there's so many things and I don't know which one I'm gonna start with. Do you wanna- do you wanna choose for me? Which one should we go for first? Damn, that's a wall. You hope you're not overwhelming with all the quest stuff? I mean, it's not you, it's just the game itself. Wait, why are you hostile? I guess they're always just some of them are hostile and others aren't. Well, the problem is that I don't remember the order. Like, uh, not, not order, but like where they are. I don't even remember where they are. <laughs> because this whole area is so annoying to navigate. I think you could go find Raya or pa Patches or Latena since you're in the area. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, damn. Thank you, Palm. Uh, well, I saw it. Damn. <laughs> the message popped up after. Um, after, though. thought I, I could manage to do it that time. But thank you so much, Palm. I hope you're doing well. Oh, there's a grace here. Have I ever gotten this grace before? I don't know. It's also super foggy to... Yeah, I mean... Although I'm not gonna bother with the, the rices because they only give memory stones anyway and I don't need that. I don't need that. You didn't hear no pe Pedro? Wait, you didn't? But I I did. Did, did anyone else not hear it? Erudition guide us? <laughs> um... You heard the pe Pedro? Yeah. I did too. Oh, is it because you're at your parents now, Palm? Yeah, look at this fog. That is wild. Okay, so is it on the left side or the right side of uh, Raya Lucaria? Is it, is it on this side that I'm on? Or do I need to go on this side? Because now I do not know. It's below? Like here? Okay. Ah, fuck. Okay. Yeah, I, I am not a fan of... of uh, like, Lyrna is very pretty. But navigating here is not a good time. South and a bit east. Hmm. Okay. I see. Ah, oh, it's the stupid... Well, she's not in that one, I would assume. I do not recall her being surrounded by so many... lobsters or... Craw crawfish. She's in one of these. I do know that. No, east. Wait, no, I'm I meant west. <laughs> oh, God, uh, we'll we'll get there, okay? We, we we will get there. But I hope you at least have fun there though, Palm. Hope you're having a good time. Oh, I forgot that there's a grace here. I forgot. All vibing and thriving. I mean, trying to. Trying to. Can't complain. Uh, do you remember where the... La uh, what? <laughs> no, I don't even know if I have ever heard the name. <laughs> I mean, there are plenty of ruins in the game. That's for sure. The names of the ruins, though? Uh, I have no idea. M 
Me and Rods need to play chains to get a chain together sometime. We do? It sounds terrifying. But this is the one with the lobsters again. I think I've been there this run. Um, well, I haven't really been to any ruins in Lyurnia. Oh, this one? Wait, is she that close to, like, the start? Oh. I thought she was closer to the, the, the manor. It's like that in between the tele- Oh, okay, okay. I see. Yeah, I had, I had no idea. Yeah, I really- I really- I'm gonna be so glad when I uh, am done with this area. <laughs> uh, did I ever do this? I mean, I must have. At some point. Is that the one with the laser bows? Wait, are you talk- uh, wait. Is that where the shrimp seller is? Yeah, I suppose it is pretty close to where he is. For some reason I just thought that she was farther away from where he is. Oh, damn. I'm just going to fall from a distance. I mean, they're not that difficult to kill, but I just don't want to bother with it. They shoot laser bows that stick to you? Hmm. Wait, I think I have followed this one before, but I didn't recall that it was so far away. That's why I was kind of confused, because I do know which one it's going to lead me to. I think. Ancestral spirit? Oh! Oh yeah, you mean the, the one with the, the viking looking helmets? Yeah, we've been there. Uh... Go, go to sleep. You too. Wait, is he leading me towards uh, Latena? Damn, was she here the entire time? Yeah. Well, I knew it was on this side, but I assumed that it was farther up north, not here. And I already have the cave on the map as well. Dude, I, I feel so dumb. Well, I guess we're gonna go to, to Latena first, then. Spectral fruit. I thought they were more human. I, I thought they were more, like, like human-looking. I never really thought of them as minotaurs. I 
I just thought they had like Viking <laughs> looking helmets, but human as well. Uh, that they were human, I mean. The spirit versions are in the Sea of a River, but the not ghostly ones are after the the mimic tier. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's true. I knew that there was a sneaky one here. I mean, they're all sneaky. Oh. Didn't know there were so many here. <laughs> um... Ancestral follower are the name of the enemies. Okay. Yeah, I I'm just gonna say now I never remember names of enemies in any game ever. Not even Hollow Knight. So anytime you mention any enemies, Orion, I like. I need I need a description of what they look like because I don't remember the names. Oh, uh, the only ones that I do remember is the um, primal ass spits because you know. You you just you just had that power that you made me remember that. Where's the big one? There's the big one. Ow, stop it. <sighs> Spew talisman. Hmm. Wait, what, what, I, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, I don't think there is anything else here. So let's, let's move on. Those are not the ghostly ones, but not been... Yeah, I mean, I, I know which one they are, though. Um, that's what I did on my birthday when I played it on my first playthrough. That's, that's when Panda joined in stream. Oh, Panda's doing well. Yeah, that's that's when Panda joined the stream because uh, that was one of one of the first uh, Urtree avatars. I hate it when I turn into a pin cushion. Yeah, yeah, I do. I really do. Oh yeah, yeah, I yeah, we were talking about the both of us were talking about the Urtree Avatar. Yeah, I was there on my birthday, my first playthrough. <laughs> uh, so funny that I, I I have memories attached to very specific things sometimes. Streaming these games really helps with remembering more than you otherwise would. Also, no matter what Ron says, these are the cutest snails in the game. What is more wholesome than a butt? I mean... <laughs> As long as you're not half-assing it. The sound of them all doing that at the same time. <laughs> I love 
love the crystal snails. Okay. Snakes. I mean, they're snakes and snails at the same time. Wasn't feeling any of the face. I mean, that's that's a pretty good summary of of um of how I feel about the character creation in in Baldur's Gate Three. Not really feeling any of the faces. <laughs> Take me to Crystal Snurch, yeah. What was the term? Cute aggression? Yeah. Yeah. When something is so cute, you just want to bite its face off, you know? It's real. It is real. And they jump too. They're so cute. Even though they, they are kind of hostile towards me, but you know. That is fair. Isn't crystal also like term for drugs or something? <laughs> well, crystal meth, you mean? Just want to dig a hole into it so you can be inside as part of it. That I will. I'm not sure if that is cute aggression though, but I do get that feeling too. Ow! This was also a boss that actually I would have gotten on my first try in my first playthrough if it wasn't for the fact that someone subbed. So it wasn't just you, Orion. Uh, it also happened with this boss. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh, <laughs> thank you for the five bits. <laughs> um, I just want to skin them and make them into a pillow so you can feel them against you when you sleep. No, no. I feel like that's a little bit different, Palm. <laughs> I think for the one bit. Okay, this is where I came from. Traditions must be kept alive. <gasps> now we're gonna go and talk to Shadowheart. Listen, listen to when she speaks. And then you can hear it. You can you can recognize the voice. Foul tarnished. What do you want? I told the old hearing brute that I possess no such medallion. Or have you come to take more from me? Was my other half not enough? Show the secret medallion. Oh. Do you speak true? So old Albus entrusted his medallion to you. <sighs> then I have no choice but to trust that this was his dying will. Let's try again. I'm Latena, an Albanoric, the same as old Albus. My apologies for my coarse words earlier. I presume the worst. Seeing that you're another tarnished like that all-hearing brute, I hope that you will forgive me. Yeah, of course. I remember when I was here in the I was like, It's just sleeping! It's just sleeping! Mm. The medallion's better off in your hands anyway. Would you consider doing me a great service? I must go back. There is something I must do. Even if I must say farewell to my world. Oh, does my ears deceive me? Is that a shark ringing through the air? Is that a shark flaring my nostrils? Well, that was too much dialogue. I didn't get to pay attention to any of them. I didn't process any of that from any of them. <laughs> Palm, can can we can we not do the the bathroom humor or like the 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 ah! bowel humor? Ah! Yeah. <laughs> 
But thank you for the, the redeem. Thank you. Also, thank you, Ryan. If you summon her in your wolves, she can ride one if you want to cry. Wait, she she does? I have never done that. To be fair, I don't know if I ever... Well, I mean, I did summon her in my off-stream one. Um, like, once, I think? Just to see. No, was it my on-stream one? I'm not sure. It is just sleeping. People are cool that make their... Bloodstain be there. Wait, people do that? <laughs> Hear her request. Thank you kindly. They say the other half of the medallion is beyond the Forbidden Lands, north of the Earth Tree. In Castle Sol, on the mountain tops of the giants, accessible by the grand lift of Rold. It's funny because, like, some of it is very straightforward, so you know what you're supposed to do. But in a first playthrough, you don't know about any of these places. So how are you supposed to remember that when you get there? You know, how are you supposed to remember that, that she said that when you get there? I was like, I actually started taking notes in in my first place. You're just a few here and there. It's the same with uh, some other places or characters, like in Bloodborne near the Dole. Hmm. Then I suppose it's time. Farewell, Lobo. My faithful wolf. My better half. I will go with the tarnished. So that our journey will not have been in vain. Forgive me, Lobo. But how did it die, though? I, I don't remember. Call upon me when needed, and I will fight at your side. Do they ever mention? <laughs> right. But yeah, we found Latena. We found Latena. Okay, let's go and find uh, Raya. Didn't I find a Grace that was like... Yeah, I was like, didn't I find a Grace here? But I, I did. I did. Okay, let's go find uh, Raya then. Let's go, let's go. No, I don't want to talk to you. Go away. Oh, is it near the Revenant? I, I hate the Revenants. I just ran past this one. <laughs> I just ran past this one. Sh social distancing, yeah. Especially if you try to grab me like that, you know? That's not cool. Yeah. No wonder I just ran past here. Well, no. These are not the revenants, but they they have this they have the, that's where it is. I knew that there was one here. I absolutely hate them. Ow, stop it. Yeah, I just I just ran past you.
They're so fast and so annoying. You avoid them at all costs. Yeah, I I also try to avoid them at all costs. And I can't believe that I actually went and, and you know, in, in the Haley tree. Wait, have I ever been here? I mean, probably, maybe. Um, you know, in the in the Haley tree at the bottom there, near by the braces there, they they're like two or three at this at, at a time. I was like, if that's a tell. Oh, Wraith calling bell. I don't know if I ever went down here. Maybe, maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. That's so evil. I know. I know. You do that as well, even when you know it's not a teleporter chest. Mm. <laughs> Wait. Where does this one take me, though? <sighs> Stop showing me spoiler areas. I don't want to see them. Wait, this is where it takes me? Oh, that's annoying. I don't want to be here. Well, I mean, I guess it's kind of nice if you just want to get there fast. If you want to skip a bunch of stuff. Didn't I use this one? I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> Maybe I did. Yeah, so she's supposed to be here, but I thought she was in one of these. But is it one that is not marked on the map then? Wait, why am I going south? I didn't mean to. There was one of those, it just overlaps slightly with the telescope. Oh, okay, okay. I see. I see. At least the revenants don't- wait, do the revenants respawn? I thought maybe they didn't, but... I should have marked the telescope as well. What is after me? We're almost there. Oh. Oh. Hello. 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 Please. Over here. Hello. Hello. It's rather chilly here, isn't it? My mistress sent me off on an errand, but I was accosted by a ruffian. And now I'm in a bind. Could I ask you lend a hand? Perhaps. Sure. That thug made off with a precious necklace. I need someone to retrieve it. Only he too is tired. Oh yeah, I do remember doing if this you part. Have any qualms confronting your own? I shall find another. I have no qualms at all. Oh, thank you dearly. What a blessing that we've met like this. The thug should be resting at an abandoned home down the way. Please. I must have the necklace back. The thug should be resting at ease. Okay, I just wanted to see. 
Um, if you say too much because you know what you said earlier, but still. Yeah, I mean, you, you're good. I appreciate the help because there are so many things that I... I forget the order of and everything. Oh. Grace. And patches. Yeah, I did. I did uh, the the whole patches stuff on my off stream one. Oh well, it, it's been a long while. It's me, Patches the Untethered. I'm still in business, if you can believe it. Now I'm my only supplier, so I haven't got much. But everything here is top notch. Sure. Patches Emporium, now open in Rea Lucaria. Speaking of... By the way, uh, have you met that girl, Raya? She's a strange one, but I believe she was in need of help. Not that it's any of my business, but if she rings your bell, why not lend her an ear? I mean, I have... I mean, yeah, he has the necklace, right? You're making your way to the Erd Tree, no? Well, I heard something that might help. A special means of reaching your destination. Have you ever seen an Iron Virgin? The clunky contraptions are whirlwinds of sickles and spiked wheels. But long ago, they were endowed with a spell of transposition. And get this. Are we getting an ad? A surviving ad? virgin sits at the bottom of the big water wheel in the Academy of Rhea Lucaria. Its transpositional powers fully intact. So right. If you get caught in it on purpose, it'll chuck you out straight at the base of the Erd Tree. Or so I'm told. <laughs> hmm. What do you spoke of before? Oh yeah. Great story, isn't it? I'll tell you as many times as you like. There's a surviving Iron Virgin at the bottom of the... Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, Nicholas, Nick, wait, no, wait, he doesn't have, oh, oh, he has market shackle. I never actually tried using that. I mean, I probably won't need it. But I actually didn't know that he, I've actually never tried any of the shackles. Yeah, I know Moga also ha also has one. Um, but I never used his either. So that that boss was a pain in the ass Please for me. For the Mar one should work on Morgoth. Mm. Wait, isn't there also one of the shackles that actually does some off? Uh, like um, outside of the, the the bosses too. A fetish bathed in golden magic. Shackles were used to bind the accursed people called the Omen, and these ones were made to keep a particular Omen under strictest confinement. Though faint, the shackles still retain vestiges of power enough to trap the one spawn market on Earth, if only for a short time. Because I saw someone who did... Cheers for that! Uh... Who used it that... And, and did something to the... What are they called again? You know, the ones on the wheels in, in the... Um... Uh... Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Not sure if it's both. We have understood it's both. If you use them in dungeons, they should open hidden doors. There was also one specific hero's grave. Yeah, uh, that's what I meant. Like, hero's graves. I... But that one specific because there's like a thing that gets destroyed. You don't remember what it was. Mm. Yeah, I don't. I don't, I don't either. <laughs> I don't either. 
Okay, so where are you, shrimp guy? I think he was supposed to be close to... Yeah, I don't remember anything <laughs> about place places and and, uh, and stuff in this area. Like I know they exist, but where they exist, I do not know. But that they do exist, I do know. You know. So now I'm trying to look for the, the, the shrimp dude. Is this where the death right bird shows up or death bird? I don't remember which which one it is. But at night. Oh! There it is. There it is. Hello. Oh, I kind of want seafood now. <laughs> what are you looking at? You trying to start something, mate? Give me the necklace. Ah, that necklace, what you're after, is it? Mm. Well, show me what it's worth to you, and I'll consider parting ways with it. I'm not in love with it or nothing. Deal. You're a shrewd one, Chief. First, you hand me the runes, and don't try nothing, neither. <sighs> Fine. Rias necklace stolen by a black guard. A uh, necklace stolen from Raya by the Blackguard features a relief, uh, relief, relief, by the way, because that's how we say it in Norwegian. <laughs> relief of a dignified looking woman from a foreign country. It appears to hold great significance to Raya, for Raya. Mm. All right. Take it. I did it's take no it. Damn use to anyone anyway. Your bloody idea, mate. Don't go crying to me later. What is that supposed to mean? Oh, piss off. What is it now? Oh, I see. You want some of me prawn? Freshly cooked it is. All right then. It's yours. If you can meet your price. I could be persuaded to sell you some other bits too. If you've got the runes. About Raya? Oh. So you met the girl, did you? All right, well, sort the particulars of the matter. But it ain't my fault she's stupid enough to get duped, is it? Anyway, she ain't all right, that one. Lucky she ain't died on the bloody roadside, I reckon. Hmm. Boost physical damage negation for a time? Hmm. Never used those. Uh, you bought way over the stack of the better crabs. <laughs> I like that you call it crabs. <laughs> Shame for him in the Altus Plateau for the co-op stuff and also the DLC. Mm, I see. Scenic Isle. Just because my sense of direction in games is awful. <laughs> you don't know how it's typed? Oh, it's with a B. 
But I just thought it was funny because you said craps because it's like because you know crap. <laughs> There you are. The thug should be resting, Atena, please. Give it. Oh, yes. That is my missing necklace. Thank you kindly. I am in your debt. Did I forget to announce myself? I am Raya, in the service of Lady Tanith of the Volcano Manor. I seek stalwart tarnished, who might join our house. You are very brave yourself. Not only a steady hand, but a steady heart. Merciless, even to your own kind. Such strength is precisely what my mistress seeks. Please, take this. Wait, so was she expecting that I was gonna kill the, the prawn dude? Brave tarnished. Seek the Altus Plateau, the realm of the Erd Tree. Most tarnished are doomed to wander the outskirts of the lands between, peering wistfully at the towering Erd tree. But you are no ordinary tarnished. And once that is proven, the Volcano Manor will fully extend its invitation to fight amongst a family of champions. Yeah, and so I never got the invitation from her in my first playthrough. I did it on my second one though, but I haven't progressed. Uh, when I say second one, I just mean the one that I started alongside my first one. Uh, when the first when the game came out, and I never finished it. Never got to Altus Plateau. Oh, and one more thing, only for you. This land of Liernia is connected to the Altus Plateau by the grand lift of Dectus, beyond the high road. But the lift has been defunct for an age, meaning there's no simple means of passage. Instead, you must seek the old ruins in the cliff. Must? At the base of the valley, near the grand lift, there's an old tunnel. It was excavated from both ends, linking Liernia to the Altus Plateau. I have faith in you, a champion through and through. I do hope that we can meet again. I don't remember what I did in my first playthrough. Like, obviously I did both, but I don't remember what I did first. Like, how I got to Altus Plateau for the first time. I don't... Something tells me that I... used the, the coward's way as the... The finger-reading crone calls it. But I'm not sure. I Like, I know I did both, but... Ascend with Gorb. <sighs> well, what is the coward's way? The the one with the... Um, the magma worm. The one she's talking about. And not the lift itself. Seek the old ruins in the cliff. At the base of the valley, it was excavated. I have faith in you. I do hope. But yeah, um, she she calls it something like that, the the finger reading crone. And I do remember hearing her say that in my first playthrough. And when she does, it will appear as. At least I think so. Let's talk to her because I think it's the one that is here. Wait, will it appear like a red mark there when you do? I'm not entirely sure. You... you're... Oh, what a pity it is to be without the right. Or without even the half crescents that wish to be whole. Unmoving, unfeeling grand lift ahead. 
<sighs> or are you planning to throw yourself to the waters? To find the coward's passage through the dim... Coward's passage, then. Same, same. <laughs> same, same. You... You're... Why would that be Coward's Passage? Um, because... I don't know, maybe it's just because it's the... the easiest way? Because you still need to get the other two... Uh, Because I guess... I'm not sure. It's not easy. I mean, isn't it easier than getting both uh, halves of the medallion, though? Maybe not. I don't know. I, I don't know. I thought it had something to do with, uh, you know, her being a finger-reading crone and stuff. But I'm not sure. So where should we go next? I do not want to... Well, we could go here. Because I definitely do not want to go to Carrier Manor yet. I think I want to go to Caleb before I do that. You can just run to get the medallions and avoid fighting. And well, technically, you can also run past all the bats, but you would have to kill the worm. Makar. Yeah. That's true. But I mean, like, using the, the lift is, like, considered the, the proper way. So it's like you're cheating your way past it, and I guess? I don't know. I, I, I really don't know. I thought she she said it because you you're being yeah because you 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 kind of cheating your way past it instead of doing it the proper way. And now doing it the proper way is apparently the coward's way. I don't know. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Kind of get it if it's like that. Mm. I mean, that's how I interpret it at least. From my first playthrough. How many uh, keys I have? I know that one of them will teleport me to the the Scion at the beginning, but I already I already fought that one. <laughs> that was the first boss that I fought in the in this playthrough. So I've already done that. So I don't I don't want to waste one on that. I mean, I don't know if I There's also the Stormhawk there for Nefeli. Mm. Yeah, that's a good point. That is a good point. Yeah, I just meant that uh, I'm I wasn't sure if I was going to use up a key if it would just take me to that one place that I've already been that I don't need to get back to. But I, I mean, do, how many do I have? I might have plenty of them anyway. Hmm. I have two.
Precipice of Anticipation. Yeah, this is the one that leads to... Uh... Precipice of Anticipation is where you where I fell. <laughs> Night Sky and Seizing. Yeah, this is the one in the um in Siofra. I do remember Precipice of Anticipation is the one where uh the Scion is. Crumbling lands. I don't remember that. Okay, let's let's just Hmm. Let's go here. Let's go here. It's Blythe. Oh! Oh, right! I, I completely forgot about this. I don't think I ever used this one before I went to uh, Fair Missoula. <gasps> Look at the dragons! In the end game now, yeah. <laughs> okay, so that was a waste. That was a waste. There's literally nothing else here. Well, that sucks. There's a talisman here. Oh. I, it helps to look around, I guess. <laughs> it helps to look around. The sea is to see. As, as you like to say. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> Did you say that before I, wait. Ah. They're still kind of strong. Ow. Ow, wow. That is rude. I just don't want to be yeeted off the edge. Uh, you died here two times on the new run. One for the enemies and one for gravity after. <laughs> gravity is... Is a cruel mistress. That is true. Um... Oh, okay. Honestly, this area is pretty cool, though. Pearl Drake Talisman. What does that actually do? Hold on. Don't answer that. I, 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 can, I can look. Enormously boosts physical damage negation. I, 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 I have not looked at what... Uh, I have equipped at all. You get so attached to your runes even when it's not near getting next level and when you need like 200k for next uh, new level. Mm.
Um. Boost non-physical damage negation. But they are a surprise tool that will help you later. Wait, what do, what do you mean? What do you mean? Let's go back to the Belfies. And sometimes it's a problem when you die to a boss and want to get them back, but you don't want to waste a twig for that. Mm. Talismans, because you said you hadn't looked... Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I guess I guess that's true. <laughs> I didn't think about it that way. I thought you were talking about like, oh, this will be useful for the DLC. <laughs> that's what I thought you meant. I mean, I do have... I only have two. Well, I mean, now I only have one. Uh, do you remember where the third one is? Uh, no. I know that the last one that I picked up was in Raya Lucaria. But I don't remember where I got the first one. Hey, Max Swarlton, how you doing? You weren't here when I, um, you weren't here when I played Elden Ring. So glad the DLC happened. Hmm. I'm glad to. I'm glad to. But yeah, how are you doing though? I mean, I had played, no, I mean, I didn't play it on stream when we did. So I played seamless co-op with three other people, but I wasn't streaming. Someone else was streaming it. Um, Rodson and Chris were streaming it, but I wasn't. Um, but that, we finished that run in December. So it, it hasn't been too long since I, since I played it, but... Playing seamless co-op is a little bit different because you can't really... ...relearn the patterns the same way because the aggro will be different, so you... I feel like I had to relearn everything now. <laughs> uh... This just, it feels like death. Um, one was in the chest on top of this place. Oh yeah, okay, yeah. That's, that's true, actually. <laughs> that is a good point. I forgot about that. You've been okay, lots happening and lots of stuff happening at work. Tired of been missing streams. No worries, no worries. I mean to I hope it's not too bad though. I hope it's not too bad. But it is nice to see you though. Half a year, yeah. It's also very different when it's NPC, a real person with the aggro as well. Yeah, but it's also because, you know, they switch uh, aggro between people and, and... Yeah, you just don't learn the patterns as, as well. So it's like, you just... It's just chaotic. <laughs> it's, it's usually just chaotic. Ow! I also don't remember uh, how to fight these anymore either. <laughs> Dude, I'm, I was healing. That's rude. What? Also not a fan of the delayed attacks, I have to say. But you know that. Okay, 
that was lucky. Oh yeah, you're one of the flying ones. Dude, I'm trying to heal. That's rude. That's also very rude. It would have been nice if you just fell off the edge. <laughs> uh, I see. It's like I hate the delayed attacks because it's like you feel like he's gonna do it sooner, and then he doesn't. At least I didn't die. Um. Real per person can more easily pur purposefully get aggro. Hmm. Yeah, this isn't DLC. I'm I'm planning on on doing that with this playthrough though. I'm just. Uh... Wait. Oh yeah, yeah. I do have to get the the. Ugh, I forgot that that's where the the one. The one that I need is the one that I didn't choose because it's like, oh, but I've already been there. <laughs> um, but yeah, where do you get the last one, though? And this is even better? Oh, well, I'm glad. I'm glad. Yeah, no, I am. I am. Have you played the DLC? I have tried my very best to stay away from any spoilers. So I, I am going to be going into that very fresh. But I didn't feel like getting into the DLC before I started a new one because I wanted to... I don't know, it just doesn't feel right to me. You usually dodge them too early because it feels like you will hit. Mm. Yeah. Expect the dive attack. You have somewhat gotten the hang of those. Mm. It's in Celia. Oh. Okay, so we definitely do need to go to. Uh... To Kaled um, next, anyway, then. Well, that's good. That is good. Wait, hold on. Also, maybe... I mean, that is also in Kaelid. With the... Oh. No, don't go. Well, it's fine. It's fine. The teleportation is what I meant. Might as well go there and get the, the grace for that. Oh. Yeah, I went a different way than I intended. <laughs> um... Let me 
me just put a, a quest, no quest marker. Um, I did remember it was right behind here, but I, I forgot how hidden it was. There's also some extra dialogue if you meet Alexander from both sides of the tunnel. Mm. I don't know if I met him on the other side. Tuesday. Imagine just taking a stroll in the hurricane of wolves appear. <laughs> hey, Tuesday. She, she just wants to say hi again for like the fourth time today. Hey. She just wants to to get a noose, noose, noose boop, nose boop. Hey. Grank. It's Grank. Why do you have to be such a loud eater? That rhymed. That rhymed. Eating sounds are not nice in my in your ears. Yeah, honestly, same. Um. Well, it depends. Like, it doesn't- it doesn't give me misophonia or anything. But I- most of them I do not enjoy. Let's fight this one while we're here. Oh. Dude, I'm- don't lock me off. Ow. I was half expecting the last one. Ow. Why do you lock off when I... Dude, I rolled. That time I was too slow. I know that. No, no, I didn't mean to pr press double. I actually kind of like the the halberd more. The attacks are a little bit easier to read. Oh, thank God. I was like, I'm gonna die now. <laughs>
Well, I did die. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not doing as much damage as I as I thought I did. <laughs> um, you can't stand them, and it's been since your childhood. Do you have remember saying how loud other people eat? But now you know the reason. It's like your own eating sounds are also horrible, and you think you might have that. For that reason, without thinking, it's nice when you do something while you eat, mm, so you don't focus on it too much. Yeah, that makes sense. His this terrain, yeah, it is. It is a pretty awful terrain. God damn it! Can you? Dude, can you lock the fuck on? Jesus Christ. Okay. I rolled. Can we go down here instead? I rolled again. Yeah, that's why I like the halberd better. Because the attacks are so much easier to read. Maybe except that one. Healing. It's rude. I think, I think, <laughs> I think maybe I'm going to come back to this. <laughs> I know I was pretty close, but I just, I used up all my heals and that's never a good sign. That's, that's usually never a good sign. Maybe you should try a new weapon. I don't know. Should we go to... Yeah, let's just go back here. 
I should also end very soon. Random tree just fell in the background. Mm. Let's use the airlift. Oh wait, yeah, don't you get like there's a there's a cave that you can come out of there, I think. I think. I think. That's not that's that's not good. Don't don't think. Oh fuck you. It's up here. When I went here the first time, do you know what happened? <laughs> I got surprised by a troll rolling down the, the hill. Yeah, this one. Let's see if it happens now as well. Yep. Yep. <laughs> it was so close. To <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's that's what happened. I want to see how far he follows me here. Ah, okay. That that I guess he doesn't have to follow me. Uh, there's actually a clip of it, too. Oh, so I went the right way. Oh, I hadn't expected to see your face again. Are Why not? Heading to the Festival of Combat too? Oh, no need to be coy with me. Judging by the fine wallop you gave the old backside earlier, I would venture you're something of a warrior yourself. It's true. The mere thought of such a festival gets the blood pumping, eh? Now, now, according to my calculations, passing through this road should lead us to the Kalid Wilds. But, however you slice it, it seems we've reached a dead end. I'm sorry to have raised your hopes. It seems my calculations must have been off. Nah, you good. Uh, do you remember the- it was something with troll. I just don't remember the specifics. Or trolling, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> As a pun. <laughs> it gives Onion Bro vibes. I was created to be a warrior vessel. Many- Great warriors reside within me, ever dreaming of becoming a great champion. It's my destiny. I can't wait until I get the and plushie. The for which I quest. It is my ordeal, you could say. To test myself, to better myself, to fell ever greater foes. And then, one day, we'll be a single great champion. The greatest of them all. Don't forget to do the uptime, uptime, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> my was created to be a one. Many great. It's my destiny. It is my. And then, what do you think, eh? <laughs> you did it! I'm so proud of you. You did it on time. I think that's a good place to stop, though. So we can continue again on Friday. We can continue again on Friday. But yeah, so what I mentioned before is that I do leave the the 
the counter here for the, the subs and bits uh, until the week is over for this uh, weapon wheel spin run. So it will it will go go um like it will stick to to next stream as well. Hold on, let me put on some music. Mm -hmm. There we go. But yeah, I feel like we've been able to do quite a bit today, right? We've done some bosses progressed in some npc quests you know done quite a bit and done quite a bit next time i think we're gonna continue in kaled for the most part uh we'll see what else we do what else we have time to do um then maybe we will move towards altus plateau who knows? I know we'll probably spend most of the time in Kaled, I would think, because it's there's quite a lot to do there, main quest wise, you know. You know. Yeah, so I, I think so. I think so. Hold on, let me put the wheel spin in in uh, the other browser. Yeah, I'm happy with the progress for today. Mm. Let's see if we can find someone to raid, though. Let's see. Who that would be. same time I'm like mm. who do we want to raid who do we want to raid I mean we you know you know who we could raid you have to go right this second thanks it was a nice stream thank you so much for being here Ryan I appreciate you being here and doing doing all the mod stuff. I hope you 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 gonna feel better tomorrow, and that the, the the whole inspection thing will be it will be easier to handle than you thought. Um, mm, I think we should raid Shika. Shika raided me like a couple of streams ago. It was a triple raid with her. Um. And a bunny bana and uh, and uh, Nikki. So let's go and raid Shika. Let's do it. Let's do it. I just need to find her in my uh, list here. There we go. There we go. She's playing something called Go Go Town. I have no idea what it is. <laughs> I have no idea what it is. But let's check it out. Let's check it out. She's good people. She's also part of a cool kids table, by the way. Um, but yeah, here's the raid message if you subbed. And here's the raid message if you're not subbed. You can copy whichever one works for you. Um, and yeah, I'll be back again on... Um, on Friday, we're gonna continue this playthrough of Elden Ring with a wheel spin and everything. And I do have my other VODs on YouTube if you wanna check them out. If you wanna check them out. And uh, yeah, yeah. I do post all my VODs on there. So. And Marty, you changed color? But yeah, thank you guys so much for being here. I'll see you on Friday. I hope you guys take good care of yourselves. Drink plenty of water. And, uh... Yeah, yeah. It's important to stay hydrated in this heat, you know? But yeah, have a good one. Bye-bye.